Welcome to Fanfiction Audiobook. Fairy Tale My Lord is the God. Chapter 1 The Kingdom of Fury, the Far North. Located on the northernmost edge of the continent, it is sparsely populated, remote, and very backward. It is covered with snow, glaciers, and the climate is extremely cold. The residents who have been stationed in towns for generations are very rare, not to mention that almost all of them are magicians, most of them may not be very high, but the ice the number of magicians is the largest, which is terrifying and scary, and the total number occupies 89 out of 10. Looking at the places where magicians of the same family from other fields gather together, it is also very difficult to find, and it is difficult to imagine. Of course, there may be, but even if there is, there are only a handful of palms in this place. It is difficult for ordinary people to adapt to such a severe cold environment, with hoarfrost on the ground, frost on the forest, most of the time, it is an unusual climate with snow, and the freezing temperature is extremely cold. Ups and downs. In the extreme north, this place is not suitable for mortals to live in, but it is the, absolute domain of ice magicians. It can be said to be a natural ice and snow kingdom. There is a saying in the magic world, it is known as the holy land title of, bitter ice region, the North Pole. Arctic region, the name that everyone calls it, the real name of the extreme northern land of the magic continent. In fact, whether it is an ice magician or an ice magical beast, living in this snow-like world is like a fish in water, comprehending the ice element in the air very quickly, and everyone's own strength is more or less will enhance a little. In particular, the precise manipulation, precision, and agility of magic power have been improved, and the power of the ice magic that has been displayed is three points higher than the original. In such a small town the size of a palm, an unremarkable cabin in the snow. Looking around, the vast white dungeon, the cool autumn and the silence, decorated the whole world like a silver dress, and the scattered houses were separated by dozens of meters. A piece of white fog rose, a deserted place, and the howling wind was like a ghostly roar, which made people shudder and feel a little cold. In front of the door. At this moment, a 12 or 13 year old white haired ruthless boy squatted with his knees bent, his expression dazed, his dark pupils flashed a trace of surprise and doubt, his eyes were rolling and changing, as if he was thinking about something. What, that soul has long since floated to where it has gone. His upper body was naked, but he could not feel the chill at all. His lower body was white shorts, and his overall body was a little thin, but it was because of this that he appeared more heroic. It fits the temperament of a child of this age and grows slowly. Me, where am I here? Don't I remember that I died a long time ago? The young man who had just regained his senses muttered to himself, and the corners of his eyebrows were slightly wrinkled, and the curls were very deep. Hey, this is. Ah, I seem to be. For a moment, the trance-like expression seemed to be even more melancholy, and the memory-related matters in his mind were a mess, and the fragments of the past were stirred together, like waste paper thrown into a blender and stirred randomly. It was accompanied by severe pain, stinging like a needle, and the waves hit, causing the boy to hoarse and grin in pain. After a few breaths, the boy's emotions gradually calmed down, he closed his eyes slightly, and reminisced. Memories that seem familiar and unfamiliar are received into my mind, as if they belong to me, but they don't seem to be my own, like two composite lives overlapping, and gradually, a new soul and new memory are formed. After a while, he opened his eyes. In the bottom of his eyes, an inexplicable light flashed in his eyes. Until now, Yi Yun didn't understand what happened to him. Soul where? Really live a life again? Yi Yun is no stranger to time travel. This familiar thing to modern people, the bloody plot that often rots in novels and TV, will come to him one day. What happened to him is unbelievable. Could it be that some god made a joke? Not only that, Yi Yun learned from his memory that he had traveled to a magical world, an era where magic was respected, and countless guilds rose together. The guild accepts the task of the client and promises to complete it, in order to obtain the economic source of this life. At the same time, it is guaranteed that there will be a lot of fame, prestige, and reputation added to the guild, so that the name of the guild ranks among the top forces, thus making it famous all over the world and shaking the magic world. And his current identity is Ulu's eldest disciple Leon Vascha, a junior ice magician dynamic. Master Ulu is one of the top 10 holy magic guides, the goddess of ice and snow. Although she is only the last one, 
her unparalleled strength is not inferior to any male. A strong woman can be said to be all female magic guides. The representatives of the scholars are admired and admired by people. The younger brother Gray is also an ice magician, static, and his strength is not much weaker than himself. I also have a cute and delicate little junior sister, Ultir, the daughter of Ulu. Seriously I haven't seen fairy tale. Don't know who Ulu and Gray and Ultir are. Realizing that he had traveled to the world of fairy tale, the familiarity in his memory gradually became clear, and the faint pain in his body made Yi Yun understand that he was not dreaming or fantasizing, this was reality, the real world. Live again. I didn't expect that I would travel to the world of fairy tale and become Ulu's eldest disciple Leon. I just don't know if Ulu will be like history, in the battle of Dai Leon to pull the demon, use the taboo magic, the absolute freeze of sacrificing one's own body seals Dai Lionra and perishes with it. In this world with endless magical inheritance, strong people walk everywhere, destroying demons and dragons, and even the legendary magic of destroying gods as well as the danger that cannot be ignored, all I have is to understand the original plot. An advantage. Thinking of this, Yi Yun couldn't help suffering from a headache. But when I think of the many super magical inheritances, the worries in my heart are swept away, a burst of fiery, long lifespan, comparable to the strength of gods. That's all, since he has lived a new life, let's live as, Leon. In this life, I want to live my wonderful life, and I am unwilling to be one of the boundless supporting roles. I, Leon, will eventually spread my prestige throughout the world and the entire magic world. Just as Leon was thinking about it, a cold mechanical voice suddenly came, and the old-fashioned tone rang in his ears, shaking the mind that had not been calm for a long time. Ding, ding, the main god system is restarting, 0%, 0.20%, 0.50%, 0.10%, 0.0001%, 0 .00%. The restart is complete, the only suitable host is currently scanned, binding, Leon, all permissions are being released. Host is welcome to use the main god system. The strange and rigid sound lasted for a short time, and the effort between the fingers suddenly stopped. Real. Fake. System. What? Could it be that he was experiencing auditory hallucinations due to the strong stimulation of transmigration? Weird. Or is it that every passing master Kakuzu will have gold finger, and now, his own plug-in benefits are coming? Leon's body was like an electric shock, his head turned around, and he shook his head left and right, but no one was found, let alone the person who spoke. At that moment, his eyes were wide open, his mouth slightly opened, and he murmured softly. Host, it is not an auditory hallucination, but this system does not appear in external objects, but is hidden in consciousness, and can directly communicate with host through consciousness. I see, but there's one more thing, what the hell are you? Host, don't worry too much, the name of this system is called, Master God System, according to your memory, you can understand it is something similar to nightmare space, that kind of infinite flow world, the Master God who is in charge of everything behind the scenes. Lord God. So, I am a reincarnator now. I work for the Lord God. Leon shuddered, his whole body trembled slightly, and an unconscious cold sweat slid down his cheeks. When Leon remembered the infinite stream novels he read before, the Lord God is the kind of ruthless and cold-blooded thing, it is too dangerous. Those who always like to obliterate other people's lives and trample on other people's lives, those reincarnations who work for the Lord God, can get rich rewards and points for completing the designated tasks, which can be exchanged for items. But at the same time, the reincarnators are endlessly exploited and squeezed by the Lord God, and every time they walk on the brink of danger, few of them end up well in the end. So, doesn't it mean that I'm in danger? My life is not guaranteed. Leon took a deep breath, vaguely guessing, cold sweat oozing out, and his heart suddenly became nervous and flustered, and his little heart was pounding. If the Lord God commands some tasks that are difficult for you to complete, or tasks that are contrary to your own heart. Are you struggling to complete the task and survive? Or resist to the end and go to the dark? Anyone whose own life is in danger will respond. At this time, Leon no longer had the high-spirited joy that he had just passed through the world of fairy tale, and his heart suddenly became heavy, as heavy as a falling boulder, and it was difficult to breathe. Don't just pass through, and you will be obliterated, it is too worthless. No, your identity as the Supreme Lord God, 
No one can drive your actions, this system is only an auxiliary tool of the Lord God, providing various benefits, transactions, exchanges, and the ability to materialize, what to say, everything should be decided by you, the Lord God. What? I. I'm the main God. So you can set the people around you as reincarnators. Leon was excited and blurted out his debut. This happiness came so suddenly, one hell and one heaven, he couldn't believe it. But there is already the whimsical thing of transmigration and rebirth, and the setting of the Lord God is not something unacceptable. That's right, the Lord God can choose his own, reincarnations, and then issue tasks to them. And the points you get after completing the tasks can help you exchange for everything you want. Whether it's blood, beasts, magic weapon, terrifying and unpredictable strange ability, as long as you have points, nothing can't be solved, and in the process of using points, you can exchange items for twice as cheap as the reincarnator. Sounds good, but how are points earned? Leon is half dazed and half understood. It sounds so simple and easy, but it is a bit complicated and troublesome to do. As a qualified Lord God, it is natural to make a profit for one's own interests. Lord God, there are several ways to get points. Defeating or killing the strong in each world will get different points, and the protagonist of the plot can get a lot of extra points. Collect treasures, secret techniques, props, cheats, etc. from each world, and then hand it over to the Lord God. Let's take one example, you can understand it this way, when it is released to kill a junior magician, the reincarnator will get 50 points, the middle level magician will get 150 points, and the senior magician will be killed 300 points. Half of which are in the hands of the main god, normally 100 points for junior magicians, 300 points for intermediate magicians, and 600 points for advanced magicians. On the contrary, the distribution of hand in magic, ninja, martial arts, etc. is the same. Quote. The ultimate mission, conquering a plane, or destroying a plane, can get a lot of rich points, divided into tens of thousands of points to hundreds of millions of points. There are many ways to earn points. If you complete them one by one, you will accumulate a lot of points. In contrast, training samsara to fight for oneself, complete tasks for oneself, and collect resources from various worlds is indeed the clearest choice. The biggest beneficiary from its chain of interests is the Lord God. All reincarnations are always working for the Lord God, and everything they do is ultimately to provide all the benefits to the Lord God, to perform all the tasks that they need, and to provide the Lord God with all considerable benefits. I'm going, so black-bellied. However, I like it, no profit, no business, no money. Leon's eyes glowed, his eyes narrowed into a slit, and he said with a smile. Leon also fully understood the explanation of the system. In a word, it was the same as playing games online. Intuit bad. Immediately, Leon continued to communicate with the main god system, and wanted to see what the system said about the points, what could be exchanged. Leon's thoughts came together, and soon, a translucent virtual panel appeared in front of him. The fluorescent screen was like the system mall that had been set up in those online games, and all kinds of exchange things were neatly arranged early. The division of chi is complete. There are bloodlines, genes, weapons, props, exercises, specials, myths, two-dimensional classes, etc. in the exchange mall. There are too many types of items, only unexpected, not impossible to buy everything. The blood of the prince, blood clan, vampire, from the cross in the vampire world. The blood of one of the top monsters, through sucking the blood of people to obtain powerful and incomparable power, the life force is very long and long. There is no special power to target, almost immortal, has the ability to incarnate a bat, fly in the sky, and bestow blood slaves, cultivate close heirs of the family below his level, a strict hierarchy, similar to the level suppression between bloodlines, control the blood family below his own level, unlimited potential, need 200,000 points. Atomic Bomb, the strongest scientific and technological achievements from the Resident Evil world, it can detonate atomic bombs, sweeping everything, powerful storms tearing apart space, shattering the earth, and shock waves blasting all living and non-living objects within the range. The area is very wide, and it is estimated that 400 kilometers will cause irreparable damage. The sequelae caused by the impact of nuclear radiation are extremely serious, and it cannot be restored within a hundred years. 100,000 points are required. Thunder Fruit 
one of the strongest Logia fruits from the world of pirates. It can use thunder and lightning to generate a large-scale group attack, with a paralyzing effect. The owner can become thunder. Exhausted power, very powerful. 150,000 points are required. Wood-style bloodline limit. It comes from the strongest known bloodline limit in the Hokage world. Wood style can be used to instantly create a large forest and form a huge wood giant to attack, 150,000 points. Incomplete version, no sage body needs 80,000, which is an imperfect wood style. Born Tooth, from the top magic weapon in the world of Inuyasha, one of the three domineering swords, the Heavenly Tooth can save hundreds of lives with one wave, it is a sword of redemption, it cannot be directly effective killing, you can hack and kill the messenger of the underworld, and resurrect the life of the dead once, which is extremely heaven defying, 100,000 points are required. The categories are complicated and varied, and I turned a few pages at random. The dazzling array of props and various functional effects made Leon dazzled, drooling, and very greedy. This is only a small part of the items, which aroused his strong interest, and more Leon did not look at it. In fact, even if Ben Ang saw more items, he only stopped at the point where he could not bear the itch. How many good things. It's just that the points are too expensive, making people prohibitive and out of reach. Of course, Leon doesn't think about his own status. The treatment is much better than that of reincarnators. The points for buying things are half of the average reincarnators. More importantly, the master has the power to kill all reincarnations. The points are few at the moment, but the time after a long time, is Leon worried that he will not have any points to buy everything. How many points can I squander now? After a while, Leon calmed down, closed the exchange mall, and asked the system. 1000 points, this is an additional initial point given to the Lord God by the system. Leon pondered secretly, and said, 1000 points, that's all, it can't be exchanged for anything good. Basically, it's just garbage abilities and props, which are much worse than expected. He frowned slightly and came to him. Said, this point is better than nothing, his appetite is more than that, there are several items in the mall that have been coveted in his heart. In the early stage, it is more cost effective to gather some powerful reincarnations. They can complete more difficult tasks. When they have spare money, they will slowly consider cultivating some weak reincarnators, so that they can struggle and fight in the world of infinite reincarnation. Under the water, I can also fish in troubled waters. Thinking of this, Leon smiled. Afterwards, Leon turned off the system and his consciousness returned to reality. Who? Who? Woo! A frigid cold wind blew past, the wind was mixed with fine snow, and the raging snowflakes fell in pieces, and the frigid cold wind blew in waves, blowing on the face like a knife, and people couldn't help but shrug, shrug. In the icy and snowy white curtain kingdom, Leon suddenly felt a shiver of coldness all over his body, and then he noticed that his upper body was naked and the temperature was below zero. It's like being in the soft breeze of spring, not to mention how cold it is. Does magic work? Leon knows that he is the eldest disciple of Ulu, and the magic he learns naturally follows the ice magic of his master Ulu. He is said to be young, but Leon is a serious junior ice magician. With one against ten, with skillful victory, to defeat seven or eight ordinary strong men, easily and easily. Magicians are higher than ordinary people, and even elementary magicians are far beyond what mortals can achieve. Now, he can clearly feel that there is a faint air current in his body, rushing through the eight extraordinary meridians, carrying out the more than 360 acupuncture points, swimming in the meridians, and feeling like he has the power to open mountains and gravel, very strong. The slightest sound was like the chirping of mosquitoes. The ice magic automatically operates, and the light blue halo surrounds the body surface, warding off the cold and keeping warm, and protecting itself. Interesting. After a while, Leon smiled dumbly, not thinking about this matter, patted his ass. Sanzu behind his butt, sorted out his makeup, and walked towards the hut. Secondly, he has already determined the first choice for the reincarnators, Ulu, one of the ten great magic guides, after all, the only strong person who can make a move is his amiable and respectable master. This pit master action is determined to win. Leon took a shallow breath, then gently pushed the door open and walked in. I'm back, brother Leon. An abrupt male voice came, and the childish voice had a hint of coldness. 
Leon looked at the sound, and at the corner of the table, he saw a dark blue-haired cold boy leaning on a chair, and suddenly his eyes were cast. Leon responded, yeah, from my memory, I know that before Yi Yun's soul wears, Leon has been practicing his ice modeling magic. As a magician, he can't neglect his talent, and develop good behavior habits, so that magic can work. Exquisite, with great progress, ready to step into the field of intermediate magicians as soon as possible. Of course, Gray didn't even know that the senior brother, Leon, in front of him, with his soul swapped, had already changed his mind. Maybe after that cataclysm, Gray, who lost his parents, became very cold in temperament, his tone of speech was like ice, and there was a smile on his indifferent face, and he greeted Leon as always. Master has already made breakfast, I'll wait for you to come back and eat together. Hee hee, now that Leon is back, let's have a good meal. I have already prepared the meal, and soon after it came out, drink a bowl of hot soup to warm up my body. A gentle and soft voice sounded slowly, following the in the direction of the kitchen, a graceful figure walked out, holding delicious dishes in his hands, and a hazy white mist opened the way ahead, whistling and rising. Half smoked and half dazed, the exquisite and perfect figure is revealed, which attracts people's imagination. The mist drifted away, and the figure of the woman who entered the eyes gradually became clear. The black thick short hair, quite capable, has a kind of heroic appearance that is not inferior to a man, the same sassy demeanor, seven points of heroism, three points of asterisk, it is very shocking. That's right, the young woman in front of her is Ulu, Leon's master. In today's world, one of the ten wizard saints selected by the public, Ulu, known as the goddess of ice and snow, has been selected through numerous selections, and the woman who stands out represents the side of justice. Super strong, belong to the top group of people standing on the top of the magic world. In addition to the Holy Ten, there are many strong people. Although they are not among the Holy Ten, they also have the power of the Holy Ten. There are even powerhouses that exceed the Holy Ten level, compared to the top four monsters. Leon stared at Ulu, in a trance, his mind seemed to be shaken, and secretly said, this is my master, it is really beautiful. Even if they were those big stars in the previous life, they might not be able to match the three points of Ulu. The gap is too obvious. Just talking about the breath, it is soft and strong, like a blend, and the temperament is very special. If you taste it carefully and appreciate it, she looks very attractive, Shaojabiyu's softness, elegance and charm. Soon, Leon came back to his senses, calmed down, adjusted the frequency of his breathing, and didn't look at him with unbridled eyes, which would be very impolite. Especially in front of him is his master, one of the famous ten great magic guides, he should be more cautious and respectful. Master's dishes are the best. Leon smiled and praised, walking slowly to Gray's chair and sat down naturally. Eat as much as you like. Okay. After a meal, Gray went out early to practice his own magic, leaving only Leon and Ulu to stay in the room. As the eldest disciple, Leon helped the master to clean up the dishes. At the same time, Leon already had a certain idea in his heart. Sample selection. Now is the best time. While cleaning up, Leon communicated with the main god system, stared at the master, and said silently in his heart, I want her to be a reincarnator. These words sounded slowly in my heart. The setting is successful, the target identity has become a reincarnator, and the tasks related to it have been cancelled. Now you can view her attribute status. Name, Ulu. Age, 36 years old. Overall strength, S. Holy magician level strength. Skills. Ice make, shield, ice make, infinite blade leaves, ice make, rotating lily, ice make, bombing balsam, ice make, white rose garden, ice make, rose garden, absolute freeze, iced seal. Potential. SS. Evaluation. The strength is extremely strong, and it may be out of the control of the current main god. Please pay attention to the intention of the reincarnation. Is it possible to escape the control of the Lord God? Noticing this system warning, Leon frowned slightly and wondered, didn't he inherit the main god system and become the omnipotent and powerful main god? Why is this possible? Reincarnation out of the control of the Lord God. Your sister. Leon cursed secretly and spat. As if knowing Leon's thoughts, the system said abruptly, 
Lord God, when punishing reincarnators who refuse to accept the mission or fail the mission, it needs to consume a certain amount of points. At the same time, the more severe the punishment method, the more severe the punishment. A powerful reincarnator requires a lot of points for punishment. To obliterate a reincarnator with S rank strength, it needs to consume 50,000 points. No, no, what a joke, how could I obliterate my lovable and respectable master? When he thought about Ulu's beautiful face, Leon's heart was full of blood, and he didn't even notice it. At this time, his mind was in an abnormal state, and his heartbeat couldn't help but beat faster. Sin, sin, it seems that I still have the same mentality as before. I have the main god system, and I have to be ruthless where I should be cold-blooded. Anyone who achieves a major event should be free from the small details. What's more, I'm not the kind of woman who can't run away when she sees a woman, guy. Leon meditated in his heart, dismissed the thoughts that should not have been there, and calmed down. After getting the explanation from the system, the doubts in Leon's heart disappeared. Knowing this is the reason, it is not a problem. It's time to send powerful reincarnations to perform tasks and earn a lot of points. Always use obliteration to coerce the reincarnators to do things. This is a means of threat, which can easily cause the reincarnations to be uneasy, and even cause resistance and riots. But use high benefits and rewards to lure reincarnators to complete tasks, give them motivation, and continuously squeeze the fruits of their labor. Coercion and coercion. This is the best policy, and this is the best way for space. Leon is not the kind of ruthless, cold-blooded and cruel main god, and he doesn't like to stay behind the scenes all the time, secretly plotting the heavens and the world, laying down chess pieces, sitting and watching the situation with a smile, seeing others who are exhausted and living for themselves. Cows do what horses do. Your own life, decide by yourself, let it be as you want, and be at ease. This is the way of my Lord God. After thinking about it, Leon smiled lightly, his heart moved, his eyes turned to Ulu who was busy with work, his eyes narrowed slightly, and he had already thought that he should give ten tasks to Master Ulu. Hey, Master, accept the gift from your disciple. An evil laughter sounded in Leon's heart. With that trembling, Ulu's body trembled suddenly, followed by a trembling chill that surged from his heart, and suddenly disappeared quickly, as if it was just his own illusion. Ulu secretly said in his heart, Strange, why do I feel cold for a moment? How strange. A powerful ice sage magician, who has lived in the extreme north for many years, is almost accustomed to such low temperatures. Now, I still have that cold trembling, just like the discomfort I felt when I first learned ice magic. If I told other colleague magicians, wouldn't I laugh out loud? Ice magicians, especially the best among them, the ice magicians at the level of holy magician, will feel cold. Cold. Hello. Hello. What an international joke, are you kidding me? It's a fantasy. At this time, Ulu didn't know that he had been targeted by someone, and continued to clean up the dishes. Ding. Ding. The system is starting up. The system has been started and has been turned on. Who? Ulu reacted quickly, frowning tightly, as if showing doubts, the movement in his hand froze, stopped immediately, suspended in midair, keeping his mind on alert, as soon as his mental power came out, he quickly swept the inside and outside of the house everything, want to know, who is doing the prank again? Who is kidding? Ulu, one of the, holy ten, is unparalleled in strength, far beyond the reach of ordinary holy magic guides. Can he give himself some kind of order without his knowledge? Plant some kind of illusion. That guy's strength must not be underestimated. Ulu watched vigilantly, and his mental power swept around, but he did not notice the life breath of others, and found nothing. As if it was just an illusion. Have you hallucinated yourself? Is it really an illusion? Immediately, for the sake of safety, Ulu asked Leon next to him, and said, Leon, did you hear anything just now? Ah, uh, what's the sound? I didn't hear it. What's wrong? Master. Leon held back his smile and tried his best to hold the smile in his stomach, and then his acting skills soared, as if seven uncles and eight uncles possessed, like a real actor, he asked Ulu with a blank face, his tender vocal cords, not like a fake, full of innocence. Ren Wulu Si thought about it, how could he never think that his eldest apprentice Leon would deceive his master? Will you set yourself up? It's nothing, maybe I heard it wrong, hee hee. 
Wulu said gently, with a sigh of relief in his heart, and his heart was relieved when he mentioned his throat, and the nervousness was back to normal again. After all, the sound was very erratic and ghostly, and the suddenness of it made her a little unpredictable. Since it's all right, Wulu no longer thinks about troubles. Just as Wulu continued to clean up the dishes, the strange voice sounded again. Ding! Congratulations to Wulu for becoming a reincarnator. You have been selected by the Lord God to become a part of the reincarnation space. When the reincarnator completes the tasks issued by the Lord God, as a reward, the Lord God will give you props, equipment or certain points, and the reincarnator can use points to exchange items and props in various worlds in the mall, strengthen yourself, and let you get everything you want. This voice sounded like an ethereal sound, as if it came from outside the house, and it seemed to be whispering softly in the ear. Bang! Wulu put down the bowls and chopsticks in his hand, and his heart could no longer be calm. The waves that appeared were like waves of waves, which set off huge waves, and dripped sweat on his forehead. Nervous. Fear. Surprised. Confused. That guy. What are your plans? As Ulu faces a great enemy, he continues to be vigilant and never dares to relax again. Was she sure she wasn't hearing a delusion? Not hallucinations. What means is this? To actually send a sound to his ear when he is completely incomprehensible. Disturb your mind. Who can actually do this? Talking magic. Not like. Illusion magic. Neither. Could it be that there is a magician stronger than himself playing with him? Street. 14 Uranus. Dark magician. Or. Suddenly, the mysterious existence who claimed to be the Lord God moved again, and the voice said again, now issue the novice task. The next moment, Wulu's eyes froze. In front of her eyes, a translucent white light curtain appeared, with lines of text written on it. Novice task. Mission requirements. Save Ultir, kill the director of the Magic Research Institute, and destroy the branch of the Dark Guild. Mission reward. Status recovery, 500 reward points. Mission failed. Obliterate. Whether to accept. Obliterate. The two characters are drawn by blood red marks. The font is vigorous and powerful, faint and deep, revealing a desolate and lonely atmosphere. In front of Wulu, as if a strong bloody aura was blowing towards his face, the illusion fell to life, murderous, and the corpse was like a sea of blood. Lord Kamui's strict orders are indifferent and cruel, like domineering, and even more ruthless in bloodshed. Murderous, mighty, cold and severe, it makes people shudder, tremble, and fear. Seeing the word, kill, Wulu had a sneer at the corner of his mouth. With a thoughtful face, his eyebrows were deeply locked, and suddenly a huge stone was pressed heavily in his heart, which was extraordinarily heavy. Is this what the enemy wants? What is the plan of the Lord God? Wulu can't guess the mind of the mysterious black hand, can't guess. Confused too. More frightened. Its bizarre and unpredictable methods make people hard to guard against, but it also makes him helpless. When, as one of the, holy ten, he is well known and has a prominent identity. How could he ever be in such a helpless predicament? Trapped in a quagmire. Very helpless, deeply powerless, people quite hopeless. Ignoring the translucent light curtain that suddenly appeared in front of her eyes, the line of subtitles showed the novice task issued by the Lord God, the content of which made her uneasy and quite surprised. Save your own daughter. Is she in danger? The Magic Research Institute is a branch of the Dark Guild. For a time, Wulu's mood was complicated, and the sudden change made it difficult for her to accept the information. Not to mention the director of the Killing Magic Research Institute, where is the Magic Research Institute? In the extreme north, as one of the most authoritative institutions, it is a well-known place. It can be said to be well-known and very famous. Its advanced magic instruments and superb treatment skills are prominent in the entire Arctic region, the power of one side. All of them show brilliant healing techniques, are respected, and no one takes the initiative to provoke them. How could it be a branch of the Dark Guild? What other minions of the Dark Forces dare to risk the world to do such a dangerous thing? His own daughter Altir, because she had inherited the qualifications of Ulu since she was born, the magic power carried in her body is too large, far exceeding that of ordinary magicians, and it is close to the magic capacity of intermediate magicians, so that her body and bones cannot bear this kind of magic power. The vastness of magic. 
The domineering and fierce magic power was in a state of semi-out-of-control and semi-violent because it was not motivated by itself. The magic power slowly invaded the internal organs around the body, crushing the meridians. After a long time, Altir's body is very delicate, it can be said to be weak, with thin wicker limbs. That's exactly why Ulu sent his daughter to the Magic Research Institute for treatment. As one of the most authoritative institutions, there are many ways to heal. In all honesty, Ulu is very relieved to deliver Altir to the Magic Research Institute. If it weren't for the weirdness in everything this time, it would be very strange. Ulu won't be suspicious at all. Somewhat throbbing. Is it a prank of the Lord God? But if it's true, then, isn't it very dangerous for my daughter now? Oops. Reincarnation Ulu, do you accept the mission? Ulu did not reply for a long time, and the Lord God repeated it again. I accept. Ulu gritted his teeth secretly, his fragrant lips were a little rosy, and his eyes like autumn water flashed a cold light, which passed by in an instant. If what the mysterious Lord God said is true, then he must seek justice for his daughter and destroy the magic institute. But if the main god dared to make jokes and play these useless tricks, he would definitely not let him beg for it. Snort. Ulu has the confidence of a strong man. As one of the, Saint Ten, he is arrogant and arrogant, and his strength should not be underestimated. He is also the leader of the same rank among the younger generation of holy magicians. A simple layer. Ding. Successfully accepted the mission, Ulu, the reincarnator, please quickly go to the location of the Magic Research Institute, save Altir, kill the director of the Magic Research Institute, and destroy the branch of the Dark Guild. Mission reward. Status recovery, 500 reward points. Mission failed. Obliterated. Time. Indefinite, the sooner the better. The voice of the Lord God was extremely cold without a trace of emotion, but it was actually Leon who was speaking, secretly observing his master. Ulu narrowed his eyes and immediately turned to Leon beside him, saying, Lion, I have something for the teacher that I forgot to deal with. I leave the rest to you, I will come back as soon as possible, if I am hungry, the first level of the drawer in my room, some coins, to buy some food to feed myself and Gray. Well, I see, master, come back early. Leon replied with a dazed look at the corners of his eyes, pretending to be stunned. Ulu stopped talking, wiped his palms, and walked away. Since it happened until now, Leon has not heard the voice of the Lord God, which means that only he can hear it. How terrifying is the strength of this powerful Lord God? How strong? Ulu didn't know, and was afraid of it. He was tense, always vigilant, and didn't dare to look down on him in the slightest. Snapped. When the door closes, a shadow emerges. The north wind whistled, and the flute played was exceptionally cold, the temperature plummeted, and traces of frosty flowers appeared, and the tyrannical hurricane strangled everything, with rapid strength and incomparable arrogance. Magic Institute. At this time, a group of people in white robes walked back and forth between rooms. The dark and dry environment gave off a dull and depressing feeling. A large number of magical instruments in each room have been placed in an orderly manner. Nearly a dozen children are imprisoned in the room. There is no crying or noise, as if they are hibernating bears, unable to wake up. And every room, at a distance, is guarded by guards. In the deepest room, a petite body is half suspended, its hair is vertical, and it pours down like a waterfall. Although you can't see the appearance of a real girl, you can also guess the beautiful and beautiful face. At a young age, there is a hint of disaster for the country and the city. It is difficult to imagine, what is the future prospect? The girl's cheeks are pale and bloodless, her eyes are closed, like a sleeping beauty, quiet and peaceful. The dozen or so instrument chains were like spider legs, tightly locking the girl. The tip of the icy instrument pierced into the skin like a needle. Imprisoned. Research. The actions of the people in white robes were as usual, very cold and indifferent. The leading persons in charge stayed in front of the girl, pointing and talking through the instruments. A peaceful life, as always. As everyone knows, they themselves will be in disaster, an uninvited guest is about to arrive, and it is about to break the silence of the dawn and turn the world upside down. The weather in the extreme north is abnormally bad, and the changes are changing, which makes it difficult to guess the impermanent changes. Who? Woo! The wind was swift and violent like a tyrannical beast, with a hoarse and sharp voice, resounding like a wolf howling through the lonely sky. 
The rustling cold current swept in all directions, pressing down on the ground. Clap lala. Goose feather snow, like cotton, like catkins, fell with the wind. The sky and the earth are connected into a vast expanse of white. Under the threat of the tyrannical wind and snow, life is quiet and silent, immersed in the wind and snow, and it is very deserted. A beautiful shadow comes to a pile. All the way is dusty, through the dustless hurricane snowstorm. Not afraid of the severe cold winter, came to the site of the Magic Research Institute. Who is it? A guard at the door, through the vast snowstorm, vaguely saw a figure in the dim light, the elder elder pulling. It's just that, with the wind and snow, the ups and downs of the world, the scene in front of me is blurry and not very real. Is it human, unknown? With such a huge and raging storm, would anyone risk their lives to come here? Think about it, it's ridiculous. There was a half sound, no one responded, it was as calm as ever, only the icy wind whistled. Hey, you're too nervous, isn't it because the wind and snow has frozen your brain? Another shaggy bearded big faced man curled up in the corner of the door, mocking. Go, go, your brain is broken. In a critical moment, if you don't stand guard properly, be careful to be discovered by the inspecting adults, then you will be miserable. In such a cold day, who would come out with nothing to spare? It's just us low-level scoundrels doing some hard errands. That's right, in such a cold day, where would anyone come here? If you take a sip of wine, it won't be so refreshing. There's still an hour, wait for the changing of the guard. In the snowstorm, a figure stood on the snow, like a tough rock, like a tall cedar, its roots were ground in the rock, and it didn't move at all, as if it was not affected by the blizzard. Magic Research Institute, what the Lord God said is true or false, so let me find out. Wulu narrowed his eyes, and the light burst out, like a sharp sword energy, a cold light flashed through. At that moment, her spiritual energy was like a foaming magic element washing. Murderous aura, boundless majesty. As soon as the spiritual power came out, the divine sense like a storm suddenly centered on Wulu, extending in all directions, and rushing to the Magic Research Institute, flow. Every great magician at the level of the holy magician is a hero, a group of heroes, and his strength should not be underestimated, especially Ulu is the leader of the younger generation of holy demons. That mental power covers a range of more than 10 kilometers, like God's unparalleled power, dealing with a small magic institute is simply a trivial matter, like crushing a bedbug, it is very easy. The entire magic institute passed by like a storm. Within the institute. A group of responsible persons in white robes gathered together. A shadowy middle-aged man who seemed to be majestic and full of momentum at the head, put his hands together, put his hands behind him, his eyes were cold, and he looked at the experimental subjects in the rooms. Every step of, tap, is like a crisp low cry, in a dull environment, it is so clear and loud. The cold footsteps knocked on the hearts of every white-robed man. Many people in white robes slightly forehead, bowed their heads, and all looked forward, respectful, and there was a hint of fear in those pairs of eyes, as if they were very scared, very afraid, the shadowy middle-aged man in front of them. Report, Lord Rost, experiment number 23, can't bear the process of the experiment, and has already died. One of the white-robed person in charge walked out of the crowd and said in a trembling voice. Oh, if you die, you will die. Anyway, some of them are experimental subjects. Find a place and bury them casually. A dead guy is worthless. Also, is it worth asking me about this trivial matter? Huh. The icy voice suddenly rose and came out of Roster's mouth. Those indifferent eyes, without a trace of emotion, showed no compassion, as if they were passing away a trivial matter, treating life as ants, ruthless, cold-blooded, and cruel. Don't dare, my lord. The white-robed man's feet suddenly softened, and he fell to the ground in fright, terrified. Oh, haha, ha, that's all. Killing you will get my hands dirty and pollute this place. Then this time, let's spare you once. I don't like disturbing my fellows. I hope you don't do it again. The scrutiny eyes passed over everyone one by one, and disdain flashed in his eyes. Thank you for your kindness of not killing, thank you, sir. The man in white robe stood up slowly, his back was cold, and the cold sweat had already soaked into the inside and outside of his clothes. Roster in front of him is the leader of the Magic Research Institute, the director dispatched from above. Secretly, he is called, Cold-Blooded Demon, 
by everyone, and he is called a demon, which is worthy of the name. For the past seven or eight years, his cold-blooded and brutal methods have treated human life like a mustard, stunned everyone's body and mind, fear from the bones, tremors from the depths of the soul, and endless fear. No matter whether it is one of your own or not, if you kill it, no one can control it, and the person who resists has long been a corpse. That's the character of Rost. How about subject one? Rost asked. My lord, there is no abnormal phenomenon in the number one experimental body. It has now entered the third stage. I believe that there will be some gains in the near future. Well, that's good, I'm still counting on her for my promotion, and injecting more medicine, but don't kill her, after all, her mother is Ulu, one of the tenth saints, inheriting huge magical power, such a good aptitude, so rare materials, it's hard to find. Rost glanced at the deepest room, his eyes were like wild beasts hunting for prey, with a faint cold light, like a hungry wolf. Yes, my lord. Just when Roster was about to speak again, his whole body trembled, and his face changed suddenly, as if facing a great enemy, huh? This feeling came and went quickly, in a hurry, just in the blink of an eye. Sir, what's wrong? It's okay, let's go. Roster waved his hand and told everyone to go away and get busy with their own affairs. After that, Rost was the only one left in the room, and he murmured alone in a voice that only he could hear. Illusion. Strange. At this time, after the spiritual power was withdrawn, Ulu, who was far away from the outside world, trembled slightly, and then his momentum changed. The moment he raised his head, his eyes burst into a terrifying cold glow, which was red with murderous intent, like a fallen angel descending into the world. I want you, die. Those miserable and tragic scenes slowly rolled into my mind like a mural. It also includes Ulu's own daughter, Altir, who was imprisoned in the deepest room, subjected to horrific experiments, and the cold experimental equipment was plunged into her body, instilling some flowing potion. Then, Altir showed that painful expression, struggling face, and slightly trembling body, as if experiencing the most terrifying and terrifying torture in the world, very painful. Seeing these, Ulu was all heartbroken, and felt grief and self-blame for his original behavior. As a mother, my own behavior is obviously very irresponsible, and I have no obligation to do what a real mother should do. I will definitely save you, daughter. Ulu bit his lip. Due to the force, a trace of blood leaked from his gums, and his nose was full of blood. When the wind and snow passed by, in an instant, the ice forms a layer of frost scales. It's a pity that no matter how painful it is, it can't be worth a cent of his daughter. As soon as the stern killing intent came out, the killing intent was like the ocean of Wang Yang, boiling like a tide, rolling in mighty and unstoppable. Call, call, the snowflakes falling from the sky, when flying in the sky, are extraordinarily fast, violent like a wild beast, the cold current swept all around and the temperature became colder and colder, like sharp feathers, and the air was full of coldness, like an ice hole. The shivering wind and snow strangled everything, and the temperature was three points lower than before. Who is it? Stop here. The previous guard shouted sharply when he saw someone coming. At the same time, clenching the weapon in his hand and pointing at Ulu, he felt a little uneasy in his heart, secretly speculating that it was definitely not easy to be able to pass through such a bad wind and snow. In the rustling, the guard who was curled up in the corner immediately got up and waited in earnest. His spirit was no longer loose and decadent, as if he had changed his personality. Hey, where's the guy from, sign up. It was snowing and the people were blurry. Neither of them could see the environment clearly, and they only knew that it was probably a woman's figure. Tread, tread. Wulu's cold and stern eyes without a trace of emotion swept over the two people, without speaking, walking straight past, as if no one was in a realm. The thick snow covered the ground with shallow dents of footprints, and a cold current raged out from around Ulu, spreading to the feet of the two of them. A hint of icy coldness, a chilling wind, extended away. Kacha, kacha, kacha. A series of crisp running in sounds sounded, and the plausible cold condensed, and in an instant, the two were frozen into ice sculptures, lifelike, as if full of life and vitality, not dead. Help Joe to be an abuser, it's time to kill. Wulu snorted coldly, his eyes were like the real blade, exuding a compelling sense of coldness. After speaking, he ignored it immediately, Wulu walked past the two, pushed open the door, and walked in. 
Slap. In an instant, the two ice sculptures turned youthful in an instant, shattered, turned into ice crystals, and cracks like spider webs spread to the whole body. Those bones and internal organs were like real ice cubes, suddenly shattered, and the ice crystal fragments drifted outside, annihilated in the wind and snow, and annihilated in this vast snow-white world. For so many years, the Magic Research Institute has been standing in the extreme north, and no one has discovered their conspiracy secrets, indicating that everyone here is involved in this matter. 4. No one is innocent. Even if there are good people, I am afraid that they would have died long ago, otherwise, the Magic Research Institute has been trampled under the iron hooves of the council and completely destroyed. Wulu is not a murderous person, nor is she a soft-hearted person, but she has a rule of killing only those who should be killed, and only those who should be killed. In fact, how many kind people can enter the realm of holy magic guide? Once in, familiar interior furnishings, modern equipment, grand sounding atmosphere, a smell of medicine blowing, light and fragrant. After smelling it for a long time, it is very refreshing, like sandalwood, and the elegant smell makes people unforgettable and very practical. But all of this is only on the surface, bluffing is used to confuse others, but in fact, in secret, it is still unknown how many experiments of filth and filth are buried, how much blood is stained, disgusting, nauseating and wanting to vomit. When I think of those children who died tragically, they endure horrific experiments every day and every night. Wulu felt pity in his heart, and suddenly felt despised by the cold-blooded and cruel methods of those dark magicians. He had already produced an unparalleled murderous aura in his heart, and was slowly restless, unable to stop the boiling. Wulu Maidai picked it up, her body trembled slightly, her bright eyes were as cold as frost, and the enticing chill dissipated. She looked at all this in silence, the anger in her heart was burning like a sign before the eruption of volcanic savings. An uncontrollable anger soared, and a fierce cold was pressing down, and the temperature dropped a little again. This. Sky. I. Want. Big. Open. Kill. Ring. To kill stop J. Law enforcement on behalf of the day. Wulu didn't come in secretly. As a holy ten, she didn't do anything wrong, and with her unparalleled strength, she suppressed the entire magic institute with her fingers. If you don't enter the holy devil, you will end up as ants, how dare you compare them. Besides, how could a small magic institute in the district have the existence of a holy magician, condescending to sit here? Therefore, in Ulu's view, with his own power, it is enough to sweep the entire institute. Tread, tread, tread. A person in charge of the front desk heard the movement and hurried over. When he saw Ulu, his face was startled, and his heart was obviously a little flustered, and he said, Who? Oh, it turned out to be Ulu. When your lord comes, I have a long way to welcome you. I don't know what your lord is here, whether it is to investigate Ultir or not, but she is resting now, and it is not appropriate to see outsiders. I still look to Hyhen, please forgive me. Click, click. Ulu waved his hand, and the cold air swept through. In an instant, he froze the person into an ice sculpture, waved his hand, and continued to move forward with an indifferent face. At this moment, Yan Ban's expression was very cold, the murderous aura materialized and spread out, the murderous intent jumped like a sword, and the terrifying aura swept the world, roaring non-stop. Pass five levels. Kill six generals. Bang. Every step was accompanied by the fall of one person, and all the enemies who dared to block Ulu's eyes, without exception, turned into ice sculptures one by one. At this time, Ulu turned into a blood-soaked Shira, with Wang Yang's blood surging around his body, killing intent surging. Monstrous ferocity. Ice vines. Cover. Click. Click. Under the frantic surging of the magic power in Ulu's body, a powerful and unparalleled chill suddenly erupted, spreading along the entire research institute in an instant, and the hoarfrost was like a long rainbow, and flew out in an instant, taking this area directly. Turned into ice and snow. This kind of cold is not ordinary cold, nor is it ordinary oppression. The coercion from heaven and earth, mixed with the raging anger of Ulu, shocked the world, as if freezing the air. The world will surrender to the feet of Ulu, she, proudly determined, shocked the lonely world, merged into the ice and snow, gathered in Tianwe, her figure has a trace of coldness, a trace of lonely indifference. All the objects were frozen in the crystal clear ice almost instantly, not inferior to the raging wind and snow outside, 
a real ice and snow castle, like a dream scene in a fairy tale, ups and downs in the heaven and earth, slowly form. With a mysterious atmosphere, combined with the texture of ice, it has turned into the most exquisite artwork, lifelike. Indoor winter. The cold air swept across it wantonly, roaring the world, freezing and freezing, and fell silent. This time, everyone in the institute was completely alerted, no matter who they were, looking at the ice and snow world that suddenly appeared, it seemed as if the river of time had been frozen, and the space was locked in one area, hidden under this beautiful, endless cold the murderous intent, the endless trembling coldness. In this scene, everyone sucked in a breath of cold air, only to feel a chill from head to toe, with a look of astonishment on their faces. This, who the hell did this? This, what kind of power is this? Did someone break into the institute? Everyone was shocked by this jaw-dropping terrifying power and shook their hearts. Such power. It is definitely an ice magician with outstanding strength, an extraordinary existence, a high-level magician, no. No, it may even be an S-class ice magician. No one thinks about the holy magician, and no one dares to think about it. It is a hopeless idea, which makes people unable to resist the slightest, and overwhelmingly terrifying strength. Everyone subconsciously avoids this taboo idea. Far in the lounge, there was a roaring roar, as if the anger of the sky was released, the sound was full of fierce murderous aura, the air quickly condensed into ice particles, and the temperature even dropped by more than three points. Come here, what's going on? Who can tell me what happened? Roster shouted violently, slamming the table, banging, and instantly clear five finger and palm prints appeared deeply engraved on the table, like cobwebs the cracks are spreading and spreading. After a while, the table was torn apart, like torn strips of cloth, shattered into countless sawdust, flying in the air. Rost's meticulous expression was strongly distorted by excessive anger. His face was gloomy, and black water was dripping from the gloom. The tyrannical emotion of wanting to kill was hung on his face, and he was covered with a thin layer of frost. Tread, tread. A group of people in white robes hurriedly trotted over from the rooms they were responsible for, their faces were terrified, they didn't dare to slack off, and sweat dripped from their foreheads. Some people run too fast, so the ground is smooth, and they fall on all fours, their noses are blue and their faces are swollen. A rustling. A few dozen people in white robes stood in front of Rost. They looked at each other, looked at each other, and then silently bowed their foreheads. That dazed face, until now, doesn't seem to know the outline of this matter, and can secretly guess in the bottom of my heart that an enemy has broken into the research institute. Who the hell has the guts to break into the magic research institute? Those who come are not good, and those who are good do not come. This person is sure to be menacing, and the institute of terrorism and prevention is unstoppable. After a while, looking at everything in front of him, no one spoke. Rost was furious, his fists squeaked, and he was angry, his dark pupils rubbed a trace of cold killing intent, wishing to kill all these guys with wine bags and rice bags, a little meal, coldly said, are you all dead? Talk, does anyone know what happened? Ah. My lord, I don't know about your subordinates. One of the white-robed men stood up first, Kaido tremblingly. I don't know. Hee hee, I don't know. Good. Roster snorted coldly stretched out his hand for no reason, pointed at the subordinate, clenched his fist suddenly, and an invisible force enveloped him a man in a white robe. The space suddenly shook, and in an instant, like a whale's breathing contraction, the magic power surged, like boiling water. Burst. It was like a muffled sound of firecrackers, and with a bang, the man on the spot disappeared without a trace, but it brought a terrifying scene of blood splattering. In an instant, almost all directions were covered with blood, bone fragments, fuzzy flesh and blood, and it was full of them, sputtering everyone around, turning the white robes into red robes, as if this place directly became a Senluo hell. This time, everyone trembled and trembled, the fear in their hearts spread to their bodies and minds, they didn't dare to look up, they were humble and cowardly like dogs wagging their tails and begging for pity. Now, has anyone really told me? There was a icy smile on the corner of Roster's mouth, and a condescending sense of scrutiny. Invisibly, the coercive momentum overwhelmed everyone's shoulders, and the pressure was as heavy as a mountain, almost crushing the bodies of all the white-robed people present. The sense of sight that is like sitting on a needle felt makes people physically and mentally tired and fearful. Tread. 
Tread, tread. Another series of footsteps came hurriedly. The newly arrived white-robed man, looking at the terrifying scene in front of him that looked like sheer as hell, his legs softened, he almost fell down in fright, and said in a trembling voice, Report. Report to your lord, I. I know about the invasion. Who was it? Yes, it was Ulu who broke in. Ulu. Roster's eyes were like torches, he shrank slightly, raised his voice, and said in a deep voice. Are you sure it's Ulu? It's her, I don't know why, suddenly broke into the research institute, like going crazy, killing anyone when she sees it, no one can resist a finger of hers, parry her move. Facing that the invisible and terrifying pressure was placed on him, and the new white robed man swallowed and said. Hiss. After hearing the name of, Ulu, everyone present breathed a sigh of relief, trembled in their hearts, and suddenly fell to the bottom of the abyss, like the dullness of the boulder town in the chest. Even the coercion that Rost brought to the crowd and the terrifying pressure to the crowd were absolutely inferior to Ulu. In an instant, the room was silent and desolate, as if even the soft sound of the needle falling to the ground was extraordinarily clear and clear, as serene as Zhang Yu, very loud. Quiet. This bizarre phenomenon was quietly turned a deaf ear, and the needles could be seen. Who is Ulu? Well known as one of the top ten magic wizards of the Holy Spirit, he is the ice magician, one of the top powerhouses in the world. The realm of his body is unfathomable, the path of magic has reached a profound and wonderful level, and his strength is beyond imagination, which is not inferior to any male magician. Although she rarely makes shots, without exception, the guy who is her enemy is either injured or dying from serious injuries, and there is no good end. After all, every great magician who has stepped into the level of the holy magic guide is regarded as a demigod, and the means are beyond the imagination of ordinary people. After a while, everyone came back to their senses, and in an instant, a huge wave was set off in everyone's heart, which was extremely turbulent. Why did Ulu come here? And why was no one informed me? Such a big event, such a big event. Roster's eyes were flushed red, like a layer of red blood on the film, and it was as cold as a demon the murderous aura came out, and the voice was trembling, but it whispered in the ears of everyone, like a reminder, indifferent and cold. My subordinates are waiting. Everyone knelt to the ground one by one, and said tremblingly. What a bunch of rubbish, how can I, Roster, have you guys with wine bags and rice bags to be my subordinates, rubbish, a group of awful. Roster roared fiercely, hissing roar resounding throughout the room, now he can't wait to kick these people a few times, relieve the anger in his heart, and calm down the panic. The holy devil is invincible, and Ulu is even more difficult to provoke, especially when she knows what happened to her daughter, I am afraid that none of the people here will want to go out alive. Roster pondered, where are the people? Where are you now? Don't look for it, I'm already here. A deep and ethereal voice came, followed by a silver white light flashing like a sword. What was blowing was a forcing cold wave that swept the whole room wantonly. In an instant, the snowflakes danced like a group of butterflies, and a rustling chill blew past, like an icy blade, full of killing intent. A graceful and flawless figure is like a beautiful woman walking out of a picture scroll, stepping into the air with one step, accompanied by ice and snow, with a stunning figure, murderous aura like a flood and a beast, which makes people shudder. The once gentle side disappeared, and turned to blacken, that killing and stern gaze, which was about to spit fire, two sword-like gazes, fiercely oppressed. With these extremely cold eyes, Rust trembled as he felt as if his whole body was covered with needles and someone strangled his neck. Not to mention Rost, all the white-robed men slightly lowered their foreheads, their hearts trembling, and they dared not look directly at Ulu's face. Your Excellency Ulu, you have come from a long way, and you are the director of the Magic Research Institute. There are some things you can't welcome, and you can't welcome them from afar. Roster's face twitched a few times, and he said with a smile. He taught his subordinates just now that he was arrogant and arrogant, but at this time, his arrogant and flattering attitude was extremely disgusting. He was really a mad dog who bullied the good and feared the evil. Ulu glanced at it lightly, and Rost felt a chill on his back, sweating coldly, and his heartbeat accelerated. At that moment, fear spread. I'm here to pick up my daughter, why not? Sir, your daughter has rested, it's not appropriate to see people, it's really. Humph. Wulu snorted softly, and in an instant, the icy cold current was turbulent like a surging river, 
and the manic magic power stirred the wind and clouds like a hurricane, sweeping the whole house in ups and downs. The temperature dropped by more than three points, and the cold air made people shrugged and stooped. All the people in white robes took a few steps back, as if they wanted to stay away from this place of right and wrong. It's just that they didn't dare, they were afraid, they were panicking, and their hearts were as chaotic as chaotic. The wind is roaring like a blade. Snow fluttered in the sky like an ice raspberry. Do you really think I don't know anything? Huh? What are the adults talking about? I really don't know, and Lord Ulu, who hurt my research institute for no reason, if it is known by the people in the council above, you sir. Roster wiped the cold sweat from the corner of his face and said meaningfully. Don't talk to me about those falsehoods. When I do things in Ulu, I can't help being threatened by others. What are you? You are worthy of threatening me. Ulu's eyes gathered, like a gathering of stars, surging murderous intent. Although she didn't make any movements, the aura of solitary invincibility was clearly visible. The unprovoked Haki, Kamui, the saint who belonged to the Holy Magic Guide, came here like a generation of queens. The nobleness of the emperor should not be offended, and it will shock the nine heavens and ten earths. Ulu took a step across, and with the stepping point under her feet, when shot out a spider web-like footprint cracked, and suddenly rolled up a raging and violent cold current, freezing time, freezing space, and everything, forbidding it in the long river of time and space. Boom, sounded lightly. Suddenly, the wind and snow in the sky stagnated in awe, and the whole world became quiet. In everyone's ears, no other sound could be heard, only the breath of their own in the cold winter. Voice. Ice, roll quickly. Click. In one breath, the storm swept up the ice and snow, and the ferocious surge, with the speed of thunder, extended to all directions in the house, like a dragon entering the sea, churning endlessly. The violent cold current with the tendency to destroy the dry and pull the rotten, crushes all the blocking foreign objects, and is completely vulnerable to a single blow. The thin transparent frost quickly covers one side. Crack. The dark blue halo is like the brilliance of amber, and the clouds are shot away, vertical and horizontal, and the white curtains drift past, hazy condensed small ice particles, more like the crystal of diamonds, piercingly cold. The air roared the heavens and the earth, as fierce as a wolf and tiger, rushing towards it. Call. A gust of wind blows. Suddenly, the whole world was frozen, and the world was silent. All the white-robed people present, without exception, were instantly sealed by this majestic power of ice, trapped in the ice and snow, without any resistance to struggle. One by one, they turned into ice sculptures, and the dense cold air spread out, and in the thick white mist, there was an unimaginable deadly murderous intention, and all the power was frozen. This scene, this kind of power, is very shocking. Roster was also suppressed by this instantaneous burst of power, his whole body was paralyzed by the bone-piercing icy air, the small crackling sound, the endless unparalleled strength, the legs under his abdomen were completely frozen. Like two icicles, and the strong ice force was still invading Rost's entire body, as if it didn't achieve its purpose, and vowed not to give up. Click, click, but, wind blade, burst, Rost gave a loud shout, red eyes like blood, and murderous aura all over his body, like a pear blossom in a rainstorm and the sharp wind blade shot out like a sword, tearing the ice under him. Ka ka. The frost gradually cracked into gaps, the cracks of the ripples slowly expanded like silk, and the ice crystals burst, turning into flying rhombuses fluttering in the sky, shooting out one by one, and fell silent. After breaking free from the shackles of the frost, Rost's face turned purple from the cold, his whole body trembled, and he shuddered. In an instant, the magic power flowed rapidly, released the ice potential a little, and then gasped for breath, the clouds and mists swirled around, and the air of rolling heat waves spurted out of his mouth. This time, Rost has lingering fears. I deeply feel the terrifying power of the holy demon's attack. This is just a random move by Ulu, just like a random blow against a cat and a dog, and I can only cope with it. The ice element swept the world with unparalleled power, freezing all the power, and could not be stopped. Even though he is an S-rank wind magician, he can't stop it, let alone Ulu's opponent. At the same time, Rost already had the idea of throwing his shoes and running away, but he didn't have the confidence to fight against Ulu. The subordinates, huh, are all indifferent ants, they will die if they die, and they will not blame themselves too much. 
The most important thing is to save one's own life. S level wind magicians, wherever they are placed, are all extremely powerful, and they can be said to be the barriers of the middle pillar. It's just that when people die, there is nothing left. Rost still has a lot of time to enjoy life. He is very unwilling. It is not worth it for an S level existence to die here. Oh, hee hee, I didn't expect the director of the Magic Research Institute to be an S class wind magician. Ulu's eyebrows wrinkled slightly, but it was beyond Ulu's expectations. Roster, who is usually not visible, looks like a high level magician, secretly hides his true strength. His purpose is intriguing. You must know that in the extreme north, the number of magicians is less than one tenth of the prosperous and prosperous ones in the center of the mainland. Usually, a high level magician can dominate a party, and an S rank can be a king and overlord, creating a force that will last for a century, and no one will dare to provoke it. But if it is in the center of the continent, that is, the high level combat power is like a dog, and the S level combat power is all over the place. Even holy demons are very common, and it is not difficult to find. S-level wind magician, living in a small magic research institute, is not worth it, if there is no secret, who will believe it. The origin is definitely not in the extreme north, at least from a major force in the mainland, and it is a dark guild. But what about the S-class? When did he really enter the eyes of Ulu? This is like stepping on a leech to death on the side of the road in Ulu, a trivial matter not worth mentioning. No matter which faction you are, since you are in trouble in the Arctic region, you must know that the extreme north is my territory. Today, my Ulu will act for the sky, eradicate the entire magic institute, and flatten this station in the extreme north. The land of the north, the cancer that kills people. Ulu shouted sharply in a swear-like tone. At this moment, the killing intent in the corner of his eyes continued to grow stronger. Like a materialized arrow, it stretched out, pierced through Rost, and shot it into a sieve drum. Hearing this, Rost felt bad, and a hazy shadow was cast on his heart. Ohm, the space trembled lightly. Rost's figure flashed, and he stepped across the sky impatiently, and the magic power wiped the soles of his feet, and then a hurricane formed out of thin air, the wind whistled, the wind pushed his feet, and a black shadow instantly reached the sky. Boom, a large hole was torn in the roof, the bricks and tiles shattered, flying everywhere, and dust was raised, accompanied by Xu Bingjing. Suddenly, the wind and snow from the outside swept through the parkway, like a river that had opened its gates and rolled into the gap. Humph, if you want to run away, you are out of your control. Have you asked me? Wulu smiled contemptuously at Roster's small actions, but he didn't care at all. Ice make, infinite blade leaf. As soon as the voice fell, the sky suddenly condensed, and the wind and snow swept together in an instant, woven into a huge net that covered the sky without a match. At first glance, it was all densely packed ice leaves, heading straight for Roster's silhouette. The amount of terror makes people tremble and makes people feel unspeakable fear. Boom. After a while, the wind and snow roared again, like devil may cry, Prajna howling, everything seemed to calm down and resumed as before. This is the crushing of the strength of the holy magic guide on its S rank and below. Strong, overbearing, absolutely invincible. Through the main god system, that is, Ulu's actions a hundred miles away, Leon can clearly see this scene in his mind, just like the projection of a 3D movie, the shocking magic, the crushing strength, like a god unparalleled, like a goddess of war standing proudly in the world. Although Ulu was very gentle and gentle in front of him, and also had the strict side of his master, he had never really shown such extraordinary strength. So arrogant, so invincible. In essence, it is worthy of being one of the Holy Ten, even if it is the last one, it must not be underestimated. Holy Ten, which one is not a shocking party, relying on prestige, relying on magic, the reputation of punching and kicking. Of course, there must be everyone's choice, fame, wealth, power, strength, these are all indispensable. Thinking about it, Leon couldn't help but feel a lot of emotion in his heart, and he also had a strong interest in the special abilities, devil fruit, to increase his strength. After a while, Leon calmed down, and with a thought, he issued an order to the main god system to communicate with Ulu. A hundred miles away, the Magic Research Institute. At this time, the familiar voice of the Lord God came from Ulu's ears again, 
a cold and indifferent voice, as if everything was in his master, and there was a sense of looking down from above. Ding! The reincarnation Ulu completed the task, the task evaluation was S grade, and a total of 500 points were obtained. Now the rewards will be issued. Ulu's expression wrinkled, slightly unhappy, always feeling that he was being watched silently, led by the nose, step by step into the chessboard of the mysterious Lord God, and he was the chess piece. How could the dignified tenth of the tenth be so embarrassed one day? There is no dignity in general, like someone else's restraining hand. What is the origin of this Lord God? What are the plans and intentions? God. Demon. Before she could react, a milky white brilliance descended from the sky and suddenly enveloped her. In one breath, a small part of the lost magic power was instantly replenished and recovered. A clear current poured into the limbs and bones, pointing directly at the Dantian. The magic power was flowing like a trickling river, and the exhaustion of the body disappeared. She lost her temper, moaning. In almost a breath of time, Ulu was full of energy, full of vitality, endless magic power, and the power to shatter mountains and rivers, and he completely recovered. This. The sudden change, feeling his full recovery, Ulu's cold and pretty face was covered with a shocked look, and his eyes widened as if he had seen a ghost, making people unbelievable. As a holy magician, how wide the horizons have ever been. It is true that powerful healing magic can remove the dual state of the body and mind, but it also takes a certain amount of time, and it is not something that ordinary magic inheritance can perform. This dazzling brilliance that suddenly appeared was completely beyond her comprehension ability. She could not detect the source of that power at all, as if the mighty power of heaven and earth descended from the ancient void, mysterious and unpredictable. Weird. What a power this is. Simply stunning. The more suspicious you are, the more you can feel your own insignificance, which cannot help Wulu's heart shake. Lord God. Really some God. A hundred miles away, there was a satisfied smile on Leon's mouth. The so-called full state recovery itself would deduct 500 points for one use, and then give 500 points. This time, Leon's profligate points were all used up, and there was no trace of inventory. If you give, you will be rewarded. There is no such thing as a godlike, extremely exaggerated healing power, and it will not fool Ulu. During the novice mission, Ulu single-handedly wiped out the entire magic institute, killing 318 people in total, except for some ordinary people, 45 junior magicians, 11 intermediate magicians, and 1 S rank. The magician who earns a total of 9000 points. Killing a junior magician is 100 points, killing an intermediate magician is 300 points, killing a senior magician is 600 points, as for killing an S level magician, it is 1200 points. 3,600 points for one kill. Normally speaking, this is just the standard price of the system. Leon sets the profit of the reincarnator, and half of the points for killing will be included in his own pocket. On the contrary, the reincarnator makes a profit, kills the primary 50 points, and kills the primary 50 points. Killing the intermediate level is 150 points, killing the advanced level is 300 points, and so on, the points are only half. Hey, master, don't blame me, who made me poor now, I can only make you aggrieved. Leon smiled, feeling very happy in his heart, that's cool. Losing 1000 points and getting 9000 points is a huge profit, almost 10 times the price. Leon suddenly sighed in his heart, not long ago he was sluggish. Now, there is finally some stock. At this moment, Ulu's face was gloomy and uncertain, and he seemed to be hesitating. After a few breaths, Ulu calmed down, temporarily ignoring the voice of the Lord God in his ears, and left the place, walking towards the direction of imprisoning his daughter. By the way, save those innocent children. The deepest laboratory. The lonely and deep environment seems to be eternally dark, and the dark ink screen swallows the entire room, like a gluttonous mouth, and it is even extremely terrifying, making people tremble. The humidity was heavy, and the depressing air made it difficult for people to breathe, and the chest was suddenly stuffy and heavy. No one could have imagined that a young girl who was so delicate would be imprisoned here. After half a sound, as the crisp footsteps approached, the subtle light penetrated the crack of the door and slowly expanded, the bright light became more and more splendid, and a shadow walked into the door. As soon as he entered the door, all he saw were cold instruments. Ulu quickly found his daughter, 
hurriedly walked towards her daughter. Daughter, I'm sorry for you, it's my irresponsible mother, don't worry, all those who hurt you will leave this world forever. From now on, I will never let you leave my side, no one will come. No. After rescuing Altir, Ulu held her unconscious and looked at his daughter with a distressed expression. The painful experience made his heart hurt even more. At the same time, Ulu secretly vowed to protect his daughter Altir forever. In the final analysis, it is I owe my daughter. This mother is incompetent. It's been a whole week since the Magic Research Institute incident. The Arctic region is so big. Once there is a bit of trouble, it is almost like a prairie fire, spreading all over the extreme north. A very powerful force. The world, everyone knows it. But now, the Magic Research Institute has been kicked out. As soon as the news came out, especially in the Arctic region, some people spread it wantonly. In just a few days, the aftermath spread over a thousand miles. It can be said that no one knew it, no one knew it, and it was a sensation. The holy devil shot, shocking the world. Ulu traveled alone for a hundred miles, riding the wind and snow, crossing the mountains and rivers, and single-handedly selected the Magic Research Institute. With the strength of destroying the dead, he strongly suppressed one side, flattened the Magic Research Institute, and destroyed all the researchers in one fell swoop. Create a ruin of ice crystals, shock the extreme north, and shock the world. There was an uproar in the magic world of the Arctic region. As soon as this matter came out, it came suddenly, and it came so fast that it was hard to prevent. When it happened, many magicians did not know the general details of the matter, and they all talked about it. Afterwards, Wulu went to the council again, and it was reported that the Magic Research Institute colluded with the dark forces, kidnapped children, and conducted human experiments. On the surface, it was hypocritical, but it was ruthless and ruthless. This news once again caused a sensation in the extreme north. For a time, the wind was surging like clouds, and the Gyuki snake gods from all walks of life set foot on the northern ice area, like rolling up the ripples on the lake surface, stirring deeply, stirring very muddy. After many days, the storm has not dissipated for a long time. The influential figures surrounding the whole incident live in a small town, seemingly unaffected by the outside world, and their life is as peaceful and quiet as ever. A new day. The early morning sun rose slowly breaking through the obstacles of the layers of clouds. A wisp of clear rays of light sprayed out that extraordinarily soft light into a thousand-meter-long Changhong, like a waterfall, flying down three thousand feet. All of a sudden, with the strange scene of sunset glow like fire, the sky is full of red clouds, quickly covering the sky above the east, taking over the crack of the horizon. The splendid brilliance passed through the window, quietly penetrated into the room, and extended directly into the room, rubbing soothingly into the room. At this moment, on the hospital bed, there was a girl with pear blossoms lying down. In the corner of the bed next to her, a shadowy figure had been waiting silently. She seemed too tired and fell asleep beside the bed. And Nian's face was slightly sad, the eyebrows were condensed but not scattered, and the originally beautiful face was slightly pale, making people feel sad when looking at it. Ah, cough, me. Where am I? Altir, who had just regained consciousness, pursed his lips slightly, moved slightly, opened his heavy eyelids hazy, and looked up at his surroundings. There are no cold instruments, no darkness that devours people's hearts, and no tremors. The white-robed man, like a nightmare demon, seems to have returned to his former home. The familiar room furnishings have a sense of comfort. Dream. So unreal. So peaceful. I, am I dreaming? Home. Or was it hypnosis by those people? Altir muttered to himself, a hint of surprise in his heart. As soon as I thought about it, I felt the pain of ants crawling through my brain, like a needle sticking, and I couldn't help but want to close my drowsy eyelids again. Everything in front of her was like a dream, and she was not at ease, and suddenly it was up and down. In my heart, it is unbelievable. Once upon a time, home is so far away from her. If it was so out of reach, it was no wonder that Ultir couldn't help shaking his heart. Ultir wanted to struggle to sit up to check if he was dreaming. Just when he made a move, he frowned, his expression slightly painful, and said, Why do you feel so tired? Suddenly, her spirit slumped, her body trembled, and she fell down again. Her whole body seemed to have lost her strength, and she was very weak. 
This time, Altir noticed Ulu beside the bed next to him. Seeing her sleeping with a hint of sadness, her face was pale, he pondered for a moment, and said softly, Mother. Me, am I really back? Quote. Thinking of this, her eyes were full of tears, and she couldn't help but burst into tears. Hearing the movement, Ulu's eyebrows trembled slightly, and those eyes like Mewchushui slowly opened. That moment, the two looked at each other, nothing was said. This scene is very peaceful. Afterwards, Wulu finally admitted his current identity temporarily. In the face of that unfathomable Lord God, in fact, it's okay to be a reincarnator. As long as you don't do things that go against your own heart, the task of the Lord God is fine. Give it a try. Since the last battle, Wulu has recollected the experience of the bloody battle before, which is really exciting and exciting. Although Wulu is a woman, she is also very warlike in her bones. After becoming a mother, such things will gradually decrease, and she usually has an elegant and gentle image. And now, such opportunities, may there be many in the future. Only by constantly improving one's own strength can one get rid of the clutches of the Lord God, break away from the status of a reincarnator, and no longer be a chess piece. Shouldn't you be in charge of your own life? Wulu thought about it, secretly communicated with the Lord God, and wanted to see the points, what was the effect. At the same moment, Leon felt something in his heart, and an evil smile appeared on the corner of his mouth, choosing to use points. Very good, since he had this idea, Leon sent the panel of the exchange mall. The exchange panel for Ulu is a version that has been specially castrated by Leon. After all, this is a magical world, and there are not too many limited things. Of course, those more terrifying exchange items are not a one-off, which one is there? Reincarnators can buy it. Too expensive, too exorbitant. Anyone who sees it can only sigh. Brush. The void trembled, and in front of Ulu, a gleaming white transparent light curtain suddenly appeared. It was densely packed and filled with things that could be exchanged for points. Even so, Leon's castrated exchange panel cancelled a large part of the classification, and some mysterious and special top-level exchanges were closed directly because they were too advanced leaving only exchange items suitable for the magical world and affordable. Nonetheless, the dazzling array of items, turned over and over, could hardly see the limit, as if anything could be purchased with points, and the power of its main god could reach the nine heavens and reach the abyss. On the exchange panel, there are many strange and special items, and the number is scary. At a glance, the goods are full. Hey, this is the long-lost legendary lost magic in the magic world, Thunder Dragon Slayer Magic, excluding the mystery of dragon slaying, the initial exchange requires 30,000 points, and the complete Ice Dragon Slayer Magic exchange requires 150,000 points. 150,000 points for Fire Magic, 50,000 for Giant Magic, 80,000 for Lightning Magic, 150,000 for Ice Magic, 130,000 for Crushing Magic. All kinds of extremely powerful magic, even the lost magic that only exists in people's fantasy, as well as the top-level super magic, all kinds of terrifying forbidden magic. Seeing the redemption options of each item, even if he was elected to the Holy Ten position, he had never been so excited. Wulu's beautiful eyes widened, with a splendid radiance, and his face showed a slight look of astonishment. He was in a trance and was completely shocked. Big shock. Even with his extraordinary knowledge, Ulu couldn't help but be moved. All the things in front of her made her unbelievable, but she also had to admit the power of the Lord God, it was simply unpredictable. If the exchange panel is true, once these magics spread out, they will definitely shake the foundation of the magic world, cause great waves, and cause countless people to compete. Maybe it is possible to open the era of melee. Looking further down, Ulu's eyes were stagnant, and he stayed on other classification choices, and some things that he had never heard of came into view. What the hell are these? Flying Thunder God Technique, Zanpakuto, Shock Fruit, Phoenix Bloodline, Six Paths Rinnegan, Emperor Armor. Looking at those strange and strange exchanges, it is even more unheard of and unseen before, Wulu's face reversed and changed, and the ability to think has broken through the edge of the sky. Is the Lord God able to communicate with other worlds? Different from the magical world, carry out plain trading. Wulu herself didn't notice that at this moment, 
her delicate body was trembling slightly, and the development of things was beyond her expectations and beyond her understanding. After pondering for a long time, Ulu smiled slightly, and when he looked up, a bright streamer flashed in the depths of his eyes, and disappeared in a flash. If you don't understand it, then don't. In short, first determine whether the points can actually be redeemed for items. The slender jade finger stopped the thought of continuing to flip through the exchange list. When passing through the options, in the end, the fingertip stayed in front of a certain option. C plus grade magic tool, magic bracelet. Its function, seals the out of control magic power in the human body, and adjusts it to the micro magic power suitable for the human body. It has the ability to improve physique and become stronger. It is suitable for the strong at or below the B level, and the excess is invalid, 500 points required for redemption. Wulu took a fancy to this prop at a glance, and felt very happy. Right now, this magic tool is extremely suitable for his daughter Ultir's physique. Out of control, raging magic. Since he was born, Ultir, who has inherited some of his own huge magical power, has a total amount of magical power comparable to that of an intermediate magician. In the eyes of others, this is definitely a matter of envy, jealousy and hatred. But for Ultir, it was a very painful thing. Because the inherited magic power is too large, exceeding the limit that the human body can withstand, that huge magic power, not only does not provide a strong fighting power, but is a useless burden, causing her to be weak and sickly, her meridians are shortened, her physique is weak, and she is not suitable for long-term exercise. I want to exchange, magic bracelet. Ulu was on the exchange panel, so lightly, the bright white light suddenly brightened and in a flash, a magic tool similar to a bracelet appeared out of thin air in the air. She, with quick eyes and quick hands, grabbed her. Looking at the magic bracelet in his hand calmly, bowing his head without saying a word, Ulu couldn't help feeling very emotional. If I had this, my daughter didn't have to go to the Magic Research Institute. Thinking of the Magic Research Institute, a cold light flashed in Ulu's eyes, and immediately changed, returning to the previous complexion again. However, it can really be exchanged. That doesn't mean that these magics can also be exchanged. This main god is really mysterious, but why do you need a reincarnator like me? Tasks are something, it's better to do it yourself, really strange. Wulu whispered softly, with a puzzled look on his face, thinking carefully. What is the Lord God's plan? What's the history? I don't know yet, but he is temporarily controlled by others. Wulu can only bear the humiliation and bear the burden, and cooperate with the mysterious existence first. Before that, it should be good to get some benefits. Thinking of spending 500 points to buy a magic bracelet, all the points have been used up, and now, my wallet is empty and destitute. For the unpredictable main god, I have no resistance now. If you spend some points, you can buy magic and props to enhance your strength. Then your strength will definitely become stronger. In this splendid magical world, many forces are competing for hegemony, and the powerhouses have fallen out of the clouds. Only the unparalleled strength can protect the safety of your family. Wulu was even more aware of this truth, his eyes moved slightly, he had a plan in his heart, and made up his mind. Although she is strong enough now, these are still not enough. If you want to get out of the control of the Lord God, you can only have a glimmer of hope if you continuously strengthen your own strength and surpass the scope of the Lord God. After thinking about it, Ulu groaned and said, Lord God, I want to ask, is there any way to increase the points? It's not just doing tasks. Leon, who has been watching Ulu's actions silently, heard that the master asked about the points. The corner of his mouth twitched, and a wicked smile was drawn. His eyes were shining like golden stars, full of profiteers taste. Hey, another large amount of extra income has been included in the account. I really don't know how many points she can contribute to this god tier master. I'm looking forward to it. Leon said with a smile. Faced with the question asked by Ulu, the lord god quickly gave an answer. In the cold and ruthless words, he said, to earn points, in addition to completing tasks, there are also reincarnators who can turn in magic inheritance, alchemy magic tools, and special abilities, etc., all of which can earn certain points. Oh, turn in the magic, how to do it? Wulu said puzzled. 
The reincarnator only needs to replay the complete magic in his memory in his mind and hand it indirectly, without having to make a copy. If that's the case, then. Wulu hesitated for a while, pondering, and after a while, she made a decision in her heart. Thinking of the dazzling array of props and commodities in the exchange panel of the Lord God, Wulu couldn't help laughing. Could it be that the Lord God still covets his own magic? Is it because he is a villain, the belly of a child? Really think too much. Just as Ulu starts to prepare, suddenly, Ulu's mind flashed, and a question quickly came to his mind. Because at this time, Ulu suddenly thought of this serious problem. If he turned over all the magic, what restrictions would the Lord God have at that time, and what magic would he use to pass on to his apprentices? In this way, being a master, wouldn't it be a failure? Ulu thought about it for a while, but still said this sentence. By the way, I want to ask, can the magic be taught to others after turning it over? Leon, who was secretly peeping, frowned when he heard this, and whispered softly, I actually forgot about this. Leon remorseful, and quickly filled the gaps in the system. Sighed, it seems that I have been too busy recently, causing myself to faint. If it wasn't for Ulu's inquiry, Leon might have overlooked this omission. Oh shit, which reincarnation person dares to use this score, and then the main god will not kill him. Gia Gia. The lord god is so black. So treacherous and tactful. At the same time, this moment. Leon also wants to find a machine to act as an agent when he has time, or strengthen his wisdom. After all, he is not a programmed version of the indifferent lord god who knows nothing. With human wisdom and human mind, there is always something that can't be calculated, to the place. Man, it is inevitable that there will be mistakes. Only by making progress step by step will the experience be extremely rich and sophisticated. Until one day, the real control over the whole situation. Regarding Ulu's question, the Lord God's voice paused and continued, Yes, yes, but the magic secret book you handed in, if someone else uploads it again, it will be invalid. Oh, that's fine. Ulu breathed a sigh of relief in his heart. If he couldn't upload points, he couldn't. It doesn't matter anyway, she doesn't want her daughter and apprentice to become the playthings of this main god, a reincarnator who is constrained by others, without any freedom. The reincarnator may walk on the edge of danger at any time, and at every turn, there is a certain chance of being obliterated by the Lord God. Indifferent to terrible, like a devil, it makes people tremble. After getting the most satisfactory reply, Ulu is not worried. Immediately, Ulu's mind moved. Suddenly, a series of sounds came out of my mind. Hand in the sea level wind magic, wind blade, get 50 points. Hand in B level ice magic, blizzard, and get 150 points. Hand in A level fire magic, explosive flame. Fire C, and get 300 points. Hand in S rank ice magic, the mystery of ice, absolutely frozen. Get 600 points. Up to S level magic, down to C level magic. Before and after, more than a hundred magical inheritances were turned in. After all, as a holy magician, Ulu has an excellent memory. After traveling in the mainland for many years, in addition to learning ice magic, I still have many other precious magic secrets in my memory. Taking advantage of this opportunity, Wulu handed them over to the Lord God one by one. For her, unnecessary magic, just useless things, is handed over to the main god, so that she can get a lot of points, can buy what she needs, and improve her strength. Wulu uploaded so many magics in one breath, and the points skyrocketed again and again. In just a dozen seconds, the number of points stayed at more than 8,000. The magic that can be seen by Ulu is naturally extraordinary. As time goes by, the points obtained are still jumping. See this scene. Leon's heart is full of joy, that's a joy. Is there anything happier than this? In Leon, a trader, businessman, the purchase price of the set Lord God has been doubled. The original system spent 1200 points to acquire S-level magic, and he only needs to give Ulu half of the points, which is 600 points. On the contrary, when facing other worlds, he will increase the selling price, which is twice the difference, which is equivalent to double the points acquired by the Lord God. Between this back and forth, the difference between selling and buying has quadrupled the profit in the middle. The points obtained by others with a sold magic to buy a new magic again, 
The points paid are equivalent to four magics of the same level, and only one can be purchased. This is not a small amount, and its high income is enough for Leon to talk about it. Of course, Leon was also a little tangled about squeezing the fruits of his master's labor, but for him, those who made big things didn't stick to the small details. For the sake of a happy life in the future, I can only aggrieve my master first. Some things cannot be excluded. In the future, there will definitely be more than one samsara, and there will be exchanges, cooperation, and battles among many samsara. If because of a trivial matter, he opened a small stove for Ulu and treated him favorably, and someone else found abnormal signs, and he went to the bottom of it and exposed himself. Then, if you become the Lord God yourself, you might as well hit the wall. After all, Leon is a human being. If he wants to live in this world, he will inevitably reveal some clues, which will attract the attention of some people. In order to ensure a foolproof situation, the supreme coercion and absolute authority of the Lord God must be guaranteed. The so-called sympathy is just an unnecessary burden and burden, which is thrown to the dog. Indifferent, ruthless. In this way, it can not only deepen the deterrence of the Lord God among the various reincarnators, but also better hide Leon's own identity, better protect your own safety. After uploading all the magic, Ulu will get a total of 30,500 points through the main god. This is a very small amount of points, and you can buy many magic, props, and special abilities that increase your strength. The current Ulu is a veritable little rich woman, on the premise of saving points. Of course, what Ulu didn't know was that the one who really took the lead was her eldest disciple, Leon, who had been secretly spying on her. The price was twice as high, but the real points were actually 61,000 points. If you let her know the truth, she won't kill her own. Apprentice, no, it should be said to kill his main god. Originally, a good-looking holy magician, for no reason, became a wage earner for the Lord God. It is still the kind of inhuman exploitation that threatens to be obliterated at every turn. This double torture is even more exhausting. Ulu doesn't care about the identity of the Lord God who cares about who the Lord God is, dares to play with himself, threatens himself, such a guy is really disgusting, if Ulu has the opportunity to seize the Lord God's braid, say no really dare to fight to the end. After the original mission was completed, and Ulu uploaded a lot of magic, Leon at this time had 70,000 points, which is definitely a lot of points. Secretly, Leon smirked, with this startup capital, the construction of the main god space can be further improved, and his position as the main god can be more guaranteed. Exchange the ice dragon slaying magic, the first stage, does not involve profound meaning, consumes 30,000 points. After thinking for a while, Wulu has already chosen the magic to improve his strength. For points or something, only 500 points are left, as a backup. In fact, in her opinion, even if all the points are spent, it doesn't matter, as long as you continue to complete tasks and collect some magic secrets, some points will still be earned. Wulu was calm, and after clicking on the exchange, a white light suddenly appeared from the void and shot directly into the Wulu heavenly spirit. For a moment, Wulu closed his eyes tightly, his eyebrows trembled slightly, and a hint of ruddy appeared on his delicate face. In his consciousness, he savored this new memory and received one of the top magical inheritances, known as loss. The inheritance of magic ice dragon slayer magic. Different from the ice magic that Ulu himself learned, the ice dragon slayer magic is more advanced and deeper. Although it is only the first half, it is the strongest magic against dragons. Of course, it is very profound. Once Ulu takes the opportunity to integrate his own magic, he will realize the true meaning of dragon slaying, and his strength will definitely increase by leaps and bounds. In a moment, Wulu's beautiful eyes slowly opened, and suddenly a bright light flickered, and the eyes were like frost, like a meteor. Suddenly, the momentum changed, and the whole world went dark in an instant. With Wulu as the center, the frigid cold air raged all around, and the storm swept across the border like a torrential rain. The original breath was even colder, making people unable to approach, and making people tremble from the soul. At this moment, Wulu is like an iceberg beauty, as cold as frost, as distant as a mountain, it is too close, and it is too deep. Obviously, Wulu understood the power of a trace of the power of Dragon Slayer. Ultimate ice, ultimate cold, enough to freeze everything.
Seeing this, Leon, who was secretly peeping through the screen, couldn't help laughing. Since the master has gained new powers, she can be asked to complete some difficult tasks. For the sake of the great cause, we must not fail Wu Wu. Lu is a tyrannical strength. Pit division action. There is a long way to go, and we have to continue unless a suitable replacement is found. Leon decided to take advantage of the next few missions to recruit more powerful reincarnators. The speed of earning points for Ulu alone is quite slow. There are many wage earners, and it is not in vain to be a qualified, vampire, boss. The other side. Soon, Ulu reigned in that tyrannical aura and regained a gentle and pleasant image. At first glance, just like ordinary people, Zhao Didi looks like a weak woman, very weak. However, only Leon knows how terrifying is buried under that tranquil and elegant surface. What a terrifying power, like a silent volcano, incomparably terrifying and terrifying. Wu, 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 the wind and snow were mixed together, and the biting cold wind held wildly. Wulu didn't stay here for long. Leaving a graceful shadow, like clouds like smoke, like sapphire jade, a trace of arrogance and arrogance. At dinner time, Wulu gave the magic bracelet that he had prepared as a gift to his daughter, and secretly instructed not to take off the bracelet. Altir nodded and agreed, looking like a good baby, naturally obeying his mother's words without asking why. She always believed that her mother would not harm her. Although Ulu also wanted to buy several other magic tools for Grey and Leon to defend themselves, but thinking about it, who would dare to offend their own Shangwei? Hurt your own apprentice. What magic equipment is used to buy, but it is superfluous and useless. After dinner, Knight, silently, climbed into the sky. The moon stars are sparse and silver like a plate, but it is a holy and incomparably glorious silver rain, sprinkled. Leon rested on the Chuang, his head was raised, his eyes were shining, he seemed to be full of energy, and he had no thoughts of fainting and falling asleep. Beside him was Grey, who fell asleep early. Aside from this stunned green, cough, cough, it's the little, wet, brother, and a smug smile appeared on the corner of Leon's mouth. During the day, he earned tens of thousands of points, 70,000 plus the 30,000 points contributed by Ulu in exchange for magic, a total of 100,000 points. Taking advantage of this spare time, Leon calmed down, and his mind slipped into the main god system. Use those points where they should be applied. As for improving Leon's own strength, he is not in a hurry for the time being. This time, some functions of the Lord God should be played. Time flickered, flying like a meteor, fleeting in a blink of an eye. One day more than half a month later, Ulu arrived like a dream and ushered in a new mission issued by the Lord God, opening the door to reincarnation again. During this period, Ulu had been in a state of fear, guarding against him. After a long time, I originally thought that the Lord God had forgotten himself, and he kept silent and fell silent. Later, after thinking about it, Ulu was quite happy in his heart. Of course, in addition to being happy, he also felt a little aggrieved and helpless. At the same time, he maintained a vigilant heart towards the mysterious Lord God. She wanted to vent, but she was holding a little depression in her stomach, like a raging fire, swirling hot, and she wanted to punch someone, but it was like hitting on cotton. Very, very angry. As many days passed, it wasn't until she couldn't hear the cold voice, and later felt that she was too suspicious, so she just let it go and didn't take care of it anymore. If you really can assign tasks, it will come sooner or later, and it is useless to rush. In fact, this is just Leon's time off as Ulu. At that time, after completing the task last time, the Lord God did not specify the time of the task. After this task is completed, all the itinerary will be on the right track of development. A new day represents a new beginning. It's time to start a new reincarnation mission. Those newly developed main god functions are finally useful, he he. Leon was excited, he had already arranged his master's upcoming mission this time. Whoosh. An abrupt white light suddenly appeared, almost instantly, between Leon's right finger, similar to a yellow talisman, the vague air faded, and the white light flashed and quickly dissipated. Small world charm. Its function. Once used, it will burn in an instant, ignore all the power of the law, break the blockade of the power of the world and can safely travel to other worlds, only one person is allowed to take one. Disposable props. 
Redemption price, 4,000 points. The main god exchange only needs 2,000 points. Leon chuckled lightly, squeezed lightly, and made a tear sound, as if a gap had opened in the void, and a blazing white flame emerged out of nowhere. In an instant, the small world talisman turned into black ashes and dissipated into the world. Seeing this scene, Leon not only did not panic, but his face showed no surprise at all. The corners of his mouth were slightly raised, revealing a faint smile. His eyes were as deep as obsidian, and Xingxuan could attract people's souls. Going in, it is full of endless evil spirits, as if that kind of self-confidence in full control. At the same time, far away on the other side, a familiar voice came from Wulu's ear. The new mission is about to start, please get ready for the reincarnator. 3. Point 2. Point 1. Open. Hearing this, Wulu's body trembled, and before she could take any other action, a tyrannical force covered her whole body, and an invisible force distorted time and space. At this moment, the reality and the phantom overlapped, the space flickered slightly, the figure blurred suddenly, a white light flashed away, and the shadow disappeared, and there was a slight fluctuation of the power of space on the spot, and the trace was very faint. The world is subverting, turning a thousand rounds, and changing endlessly. Wulu lost consciousness without struggling, and when he woke up again, he had appeared in a new place, with unfamiliar interior decorations, completely unlike in a small town, as if the Lord God had cast a god tear pass with one hand. Force traverses time and space, moving her whole body to another area. How mighty, how supreme. At this time, she was in a dark and humid environment, surrounded by icy copper walls and iron walls. At the door, the surrounding, Neighbors, were all guys wearing black shackles and prison uniforms with long chains on their ribs. These detained prisoners, both male and female, in the darkness and stillness, with the faint pupil light like a wicked wolf, are full of fierce and fierce aura, like Wang Yang, terrifying and abnormal. Without exception, each one's breath is extremely terrifying. Although there is no imposing manner, the air exudes a very depressed and dull feeling, as if each of them has a prehistoric beast hidden in their bodies, half asleep and half awake. In the middle, the cold breath is extremely terrifying. Obviously, this is a prison for prisoners. And it is a concentration camp of a group of extraordinary strength, terrible monsters. Here, where is it? When Ulu woke up, the first thing she found was that the place where she was staying was not in the original town, it looked like a very dim prison. After a while, she was shaken physically and mentally, she pursed her lower lip slightly, and her face paled. There was a cryptic sinking, and it was obvious that he had suspected some kind of shuddering thought. Isn't this arctic? Or rather, as if hearing Ulu's voice, a light curtain suddenly appeared in front of her eyes, and the words emerged one by one. The indifferent voice of the Lord God resounded in Ulu's mind. Now start publishing the task, please pay attention to the reincarnators. Current world, pirate world. Deep Sea Prison, Impel Down, an invincible and invincible prison located on the endless seabed, where countless felons are detained, and it is the largest prison in the pirate world. The periphery of the prison is trapped by several huge Uzumaki currents, and there are far more warships than the number of buster calls docked around. The seabed is the world of sea kings. There are all kinds of powerful sea kings. The strength of rear admiral level, the only passage, only the huge gate like the scorpion called the gate of justice, can come and go. The security measures inside are extremely strict, and the experts are like clouds. Its strongest combat power has the same level of strength as the Ennies Lobby Ennies Hall CP9 and the highest combat strength admiral of the naval headquarters of the other two major institutions of the world government. Under the highest level of combat power, escape from prison. Therefore, the deep sea prison is also known as the copper wall and iron wall which is known as the strongest barrier. At least until the Golden Lion jailbreak, it should be. So not long ago, an incredible thing happened here. In the course of history, it is an unprecedented event, and that is the Golden Lion prison break incident. As soon as it happened, the world was shocked and the world shook. This is a fortress building that has made countless pirates terrified, made all marines proud, and amazed the world. It is also a huge prison known as, Copper Walls and Iron Walls. It is completely under the feet of the legendary great pirate Shaki, out, crushed. 
Because of this uproar, Impel's alert level has been lowered, and the defense has been raised again. It is surrounded like an iron barrel, extremely strict. Main quest. Escape from Impel down, defeat the warden chief, and defeat the siege of warships with invincibility, reach the gate of justice, and leave through it. Mission success. 6,000 points will be awarded, as well as an ordinary lottery draw. Failure. 5,000 points will be deducted. Those with insufficient points will have their equipment deducted. Those who are reincarnated can sell the Ice Dragon Slayer magic, the first stage, at a discount. Task duration. One day. Determine the kill mission. Kill the S-plus level powerhouse, Admiral is at the martial level, to get 1200 points. If you kill an S-rank strong, Vice Admiral is between Admiral, you will get 600 points. And if you kill an A-rank strong, Vice Admiral is between Commodore, you will get 300 points. Kill the B rank strong, the colonel is between the major, you can get 150 points, and kill the C rank strong, the captain is between the ensign, you can get 50 points. Seeing this scene, Ulu Maidai slightly wrinkled, her heart sank, and her heart became more and more heavy. I actually came to another world. It seems that this mysterious lord god is really strong and makes people tremble. I don't know how many terrifying methods have not been used. For the task released by the main god, Ulu was surprised that he really traveled to other worlds. Although he had long expected that this so-called main god had a very terrifying strength, at the moment of the real face, Ulu still had a feeling of despair in his heart, and it spread in an uncontrollable trend. The stronger the Lord God is, the more difficult it is for him to break free from his control. Is it really possible to get rid of it? Those black hands that cover the sky and the sun are eternal. After being silent for a while, Ulu's complicated mood calmed down, and he raised his head slightly, his eyes were like torches, as bright as the moon, and there was a trace of freedom in his eyes. Unwilling, that is also the proud color of her not giving in and needing to anyone. Can't get rid of it. Ulu doesn't believe it, there must be a way, maybe only when her strength rises to a certain level again, she can understand a little bit. After thinking about it, Ulu felt a lot easier in his heart. If he was relieved, he glanced at the surrounding environment. Looking at the row after row of prisoners, the ancient well had a waveless expression, a trace of cold killing intent flashed across the corner of his eyes, and the chilling air spread out, and the temperature suddenly turned and dropped by three points. Since this is a prison, all those who stay in the prison are heinous murderers. Ulu said softly. His eyes jumped like swords, and he wanted to shoot, which was extremely unkind. What she hated most were those who were fishy and fleshy civilians, who killed innocent people indiscriminately, especially after the incident with her daughter, her heart became a little colder. As soon as the killing intent came out, a terrifying murderous aura burst forth uncontrollably. Immediately, Ulu raised his mouth slightly, revealing a very cold smile, like an angel covered in blood, and his wings were about to be smeared with blood. If it wasn't for completing the mission, I really wanted to kill the blood here. His eyes narrowed into a serpentine crevice, and then Ulu snorted softly, saying, Well, this is not my world. What am I worried about? Staying in prison, you can't do evil again. I just hope that when the time comes, you will have better luck and survive. Ulu took a long deep breath, soothing the extremely suppressed emotions in his heart, and the murderous intention lurked. Prison break. At that time, once the battle is involved, the most dead are probably these imprisoned villains, who are trapped by Seastone. These guys, even the great pirates who have crossed the Grand Line and are famous all over the world, have no strength to resist. Moreover, they were all sinners who died. Ulu had no turbulence in his heart, let alone any compassion, his eyes were as clear as a lake, and there was no burden in his heart. The calm side makes people feel fearful and uneasy. Ding. The voice generation is complete, the mission begins. The cold voice of the Lord God came to his ears again, and at this time, Leon removed the protective cover. At this moment, a layer of faint white protective cover around Ulu four or five meters away gradually brightened, and in an instant, it was like a burning prairie, turned into a sea of stars, and dissipated. Hearing the voice of the Lord God, Ulu glanced around, and there was a hint of relief in the corner of his eyes. No wonder he was not discovered. It turned out that he was protected by this mask, but his mind was wandering elsewhere at that time. Clearly noticed that it is too obscure, such as setting one end of the void to become invisible. 
This is Leon spent 10,000 points to buy this protective cover from the system, during which it provides 3 minutes of protection for the reincarnator, with a stealth state, and it has the effect of sound insulation. And spend 5,000 points to buy a language device, so that in the future, every traveler will automatically generate the local language of the mission world, so there is no need to worry about any communication barriers. As soon as the mask dissipated, Wulu was completely exposed in level 6 eternal hell, under the eyes of all the powerhouses imprisoned here. Then let me see how strong the powerhouses in this world are. After thinking about it carefully, Wulu's body suddenly boiled with blood, as if the flowing blood was attached to a fiery flame, burning continuously. In the magical world, magicians with terrifying strength like the ten great magicians are restricted and restrained by the council, and they cannot easily fight against each other at the same level. The power of the holy demon is like a god. Zhao Zhao regrets the sky, wants to collapse the world. Coming to a new world, people are like dragons entering the sea, their strength can be unscrupulously displayed, and no one can control them. The kind of ambition that breeds erupts like a volcano. Swish, swish, swish. Just when Leon removed the protective cover, Wulu was exposed to the eternal hell on the sixth floor. Like lightning, the figure appeared out of nowhere, and it came very suddenly. Eternal hell was so big, a figure suddenly appeared, and it suddenly alerted many imprisoned bigwigs. Ha, huh, newbie. With an exclamation, it sounded. Immediately, it attracted the attention of the prisoners. Huh, strange. Where did you get the girl movie? Is it new? Why don't you know? The big pirate who was in the new world yawned and said sleepily, his eyes floating up, sleepy. In the half days, he glanced at him without leaving a trace, and quickly retracted, paradoxically, he lowered his head slightly, like a sleeping lion, majestic and terrifying. It's actually a woman. It's really interesting. The people who can be imprisoned in eternal hell are big pirates with a reward of hundreds of millions. How can a woman be like this, a new supernova outside? Woman, it turns out to be a woman, ha ha ha, I haven't tasted a woman for a long time. I want her, I want to ravage her well. After being detained for a long time, some of the pirates have long been unable to bear the loneliness of the time, and their spirits have collapsed. Female pirates are scarce in their own right especially since they are naturally weak, they fight all the way, and they struggle to become the top powerhouses, and even fewer are famous in the world. Shut up, you fool, disgusting, drooling all over me. Hey, 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 new here, what's your name? By the way, when did she come, it doesn't seem like she was brought in. Someone is suspicious. At this moment, the prison is noisy, just like a vegetable market selling flowers, fruits and vegetables, it is noisy and chaotic. Many self-proclaimed powerhouses just glanced at them indifferently, then stopped paying attention, closing their eyes and resting their minds, and fell into a deep sleep. In their eyes, how high is your predecessor's status? Across the world, roaming the Grand Line, and even roaming the New World, making Marine tremble and making the government fearful, but as long as you enter impel down, the future will be broken, and everything will be nonsense and empty dreams. The detainees here are the losers of the times. If there are no exceptions, it will never come out. Lifetime. Shen rot in this cold prison. No, wait, she really doesn't seem to be a prisoner. Look, she doesn't wear the shackles of Seastone at all. The sharp-eyed pirate blurted out, swallowed, and his face was surprised, as if he couldn't believe it. As soon as these words came out, like a stone falling into a lake, there was a ripple of waves, and immediately rolled up a piece of rippled net wave Uzumaki, ups and downs. What? In an instant, those terrifying powerhouses suddenly opened their eyes. If the lion wakes up, it will burst into a burst of light, shooting like a rainbow of lightning, and it will traverse the void. The airflow will freeze in an instant. The majestic boiling, surging out, swept the entire eternal hell. The heaviness of boundless repression, the mighty and profound coercion, like the aura of the king of the nine heavens and eight desolations, the negative mountain is coming. The sound of, boom, sounded like a thunderous explosion. In an instant, the space suddenly shook, as if it were a lifetime away, white lights criss-crossed in the void, like a substantial white patch, filling the entire eternal hell. Swish, 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 the countless powerful and unparalleled forces, the force twisting the void, all merged in one place at this moment, 
and flew towards the place where Ulu was, with that kind of domineering peeping. That's observation hockey. Although Sea Stone restrains all the prisoners, it does not mean that they do not have the slightest resistance. Hockey is one of their reliances. Even observation hockey, who has been practicing for a long time, carries a sense of awe, and has an indifferent and vast coercion. These super powerhouses who have been imprisoned for an unknown period of time, even for more than 10 years, are still vaguely old-fashioned powerhouses from the One Piece era, and their strength is completely unimaginable. These people are imprisoned in the eternal hell on the sixth floor, without exception, all of them are strong in hockey, experienced in the battlefield, each is a big pirate on one side, or a arrogant in marine. The characters are extremely powerful and should not be underestimated. Among the observation hockeys, there is no lack of the strongest conqueror's hockey. The momentum is extremely terrifying, unparalleled, and the coercion like a landslide and ground cracks, boundlessly rushed to the direction of Ulu, rolling in. Overwhelming eternal hell in an instant, the magnificent and terrifying hockey swept across the fifth floor freezing hell. Blazing hell, starvation hell, and finally ran to crimson hell on the first floor. The six-layered hell is a vast area with tens of thousands of people. At this moment, everyone in Impel Down was shocked. No one is blown away by this hockey. All tremble. Okay. Due to the Golden Lion incident, the former director was demoted to another place. Magellan, who had just taken office not long ago, raised his long eyebrows and swayed gently twice. At this moment, Magellan also felt this amazing hockey, dense but terrifying, so powerful that it seemed to overturn the entire impel down. Ah, what's going on? What's going on down there? Could it be to give me this newly appointed director, a slap in the face? Magellan was shocked, his face was blank, and his mind is still a mess, and he doesn't understand what happened. What? Gululu, squeak, goo goo. There was another rumbling noise in the stomach, like the howling of a wild boar. Whoops, my stomach is starting to churn again. It doesn't matter, what can happen? Magellan's face was covered with bitterness, and the blue veins like a horned dragon stood out, as if in pain, like a pale face with excessive force and powerlessness, sweat dripping continuously. At this moment, he was squatting on the toilet. As a man who had eaten poisonous fruit, his body was full of violent toxins, so that the poison was too strong for him to bear, causing diarrhea and diarrhea for nearly 10 hours a day. For hours, the toilet was filled with an unpleasant odor, and he almost fainted. In a word, it sucks. It is indeed the famous, toilet squat, in marine. The incomparable observation hockey carries the mighty might, as if overturning the river and raging the sea, like a dragon doing evil, ravaging the entire eternal hell, and the world suddenly turned pale. Boom. A series of Jiao thunder sounds were active, and the explosions and thunder roared endlessly for a long time. Haki is as surging and mighty as Wang Yang, and his blood is like a long rainbow, boundless and boundless. Countless gazes pierced out like a waterfall like a pistol, and the terrifying aura shocked the scene, like a big mountain suppressing it again, the incomparable pressure continued to climb, and the air exuded a depressing breath, which was very dull. Everything Uzumaki originates from the center, from the direction of Ulu. Facing the countless eyes that were like sharp swords, Ulu was calm and calm, as if Taishan collapsed in front of him without changing color, without any fear. Suddenly, Ulu's eyes were slightly cold, with a sharp arc of light like a sword, and a needle like on, coldly swept over the prisoners who were constantly shouting, and the cold breath suddenly became colder. Every word indeed is full of icy coldness, as cold as an iceberg. Bing beauty, at this moment, it is as cold as Ching Han Aoshui. Humph. She snorted softly, like a saint's anger, the thunder sneered softly, and the air of ice and snow hit all directions in an instant, and then, the temperature of eternal hell suddenly changed, and suddenly dropped by three or four points. Ohm, sounded lightly. The air was turbulent, and in an instant, there were a few soft and crisp sounds of, kacha kacha, and the space tore out the gaps and leaks, and the force produced strong distortions, faintly overlapping, like water. The swaying, the void shattered like a mirror. The holy demon was furious, and Kamui was incomparable. Haki, who was still out of control just now, was like the moment when a boiling river hit, the world suddenly became sad, and Wang Yang returned in an instant, humming with the coercion of the world mixed with Ulu. Disturbed airflow. 
In the blink of an eye, there was a riot. It is as sharp as a blade, like cutting tofu, forming a strong hurricane, easily piercing the space, rolling through Haki's prison lock, and instantly spilling a stream of mercury, sparkling and extraordinarily bright. As soon as it was resolved, Wulu seemed to send the cats and dogs at will, but it was easy. At this moment, the detained prisoners, whether they are the dominating party, the big pirate who is rampant, or the rebellious marine who has no king's law, are all shocked, as if they are delusional, and their hearts are cold. He breathed a sigh of relief, surprised. The sky-covering observation hockey, even without the shock of conqueror's hockey, the terrifying power is enough to crush everyone present, making them tremble and tremble. At this moment, it was torn to shreds like a piece of paper in Ulu's hands, annihilated into nothingness, and his hair was undamaged. If it was them, they might not be able to solve it so easily. This woman is really strong and terrifying. When everyone thought of this, their faces changed dramatically, and they couldn't help but exclaimed in amazement. Is this the power of the pirate world? It is somewhat similar to the magician's spiritual power, but it is different. Each system is in a line, especially the invisible power, which is similar to the power of the sky, intimidating the mind. As someone with insufficient strength, I am afraid that I would have fainted long ago. Wulu murmured, but it was calm as usual. With a calm expression, she glanced at the prisoner indifferently without leaving a trace, and quickly turned her gaze back. With a determined expression, perhaps he never put everyone on the sixth floor in his eyes. Like Shisui, the ancient well has no waves, can't you tell it's high? Is it anger? With a look that no strangers should approach, Ruo Ran's frost is blowing towards his face, and the cold is daunting. Then, she finally acted. Jailbreak begins. In fact, as one of the top 10 holy magic guides, Wulu didn't want to get involved in the prisoners' affairs, but they deliberately provoked and provoked themselves for no reason. Wulu was naturally angry and had the responsibility to teach this the aborigines of the world, let them know what the wrath of the holy devil is, like a god. Wulu's eyes shone with cold light, and he stomped his feet gently, like a lotus stepping, and a light blue magic circle appeared under his feet. Weird and charming, the formations are all shiny, like crystal blue jade. A vision, a large amount of icy cold air spreads with the trend of destroying the dead. Crack knock knock. In one breath, the entire eternal hell turned into an ice and snow world, with ice crystals raging and fields crowded. Snow Queen, hockey is here. Ah, everyone was stunned, looking at the scene in front of them, their faces were muddled, their minds were a little dazed, the raging ice and snow attacked the skin, and the faint tingling pain was not a dream at all, as if a voice in their hearts said, this is true, she, to escape. Another golden lion, and unlike golden lion, Ulu is an intact jailbreak, and its strength is definitely at its peak. These powerhouses are all face sinking like water, and their faces are dignified. At this time, everyone didn't have time to think about where Ulu came from, or whether he was a prisoner here, in short, their mood boiled at this moment. Not caring about their dignity, many of the once invincible bigwigs roared and roared, and the sixth floor was full of noise and chaos. Let me out, woman, let me out. Please save me and take me out. I have several treasures hidden outside. As long as you save me, I will grant you any request. I've hidden three devil fruits in private. As long as you take me out, I'll give them all to you. I, I can still be your subordinate. My strength is very strong. Wulu turned a blind eye, stepped out, wrapped in the wind and snow, rose to the sky, the wind was blowing under his feet, and a white frost spewed out. This frost is raging, like a white rainbow waterfall, which is born out of thin air, and points directly to the fifth layer of ice hell. With the sound of, boom, the hell on the sixth floor trembled. Countless bricks, tiles and bluestones shattered and rose into the sky in the impact of the strong frost of Ulu. The endless smoke and dust, billowing like a mighty river, poured out at this moment. Ice crystals raged and frost spread. The sixth floor, broken. Thanks for watching, please subscribe and support my channel.